My friends, welcome to the stream. Happy Zelda Day. We're here celebrating Zelda Tears of the Kingdom on Nintendo Switch. It has been six years since Breath of the Wild. Six friggin' years. It was the last, one of the last games on the Wii U and a launch game for the new gen, which was Nintendo Switch. Welcome to the stream, my friends. <coughs> JT is here with Scott. Fat Stan has arrived. Cutthroat Comics, Retro Roamers. I appreciate you guys talking in the chat, hanging out with me. We're going to have a great afternoon. I have not touched this. It is installed. I have literally not done anything. Well, excuse me, princess. And Destro, the mighty Destro is here. Will I buy this game? We'll soon find out. I'm hoping a lot of the issues that I had with the game have been addressed. We're going to find out. Are you guys ready to play some Dragon's Lair? I'm just kidding. <laughs> or we could play Contra Collection if you want to play that instead. Let's just play Contra. I'm just kidding. Here we go. I'll remain quiet for as much as I can of the intro. TJ is here as well. Welcome. Here we go. 
exciting. I got goosebumps already. Strange bloom keeps getting thicker. Agreed, very dramatic. We've been descending for a while now. These tunnels are deeper than I thought. What could be down here? Cool. We have control. Oh my god, we have full hearts. Look at that. Guys, once again, I have not watched any reviews, nothing on this game except the one trailer. So this is all brand new. Beneath Hyrule Castle. This is clearly after the events of the first game. Somehow I think that uh, we're not going to keep all these hearts. <laughs> Skyfall two for two, buddy. Yeah, yeah. People have been falling ill after coming into contact with the gloom drifting through these caverns. Though here it seems almost misty and not concentrated enough to harm us. We'll keep going. I keep coming up from beneath Hyrule Castle. Hey, Jeff. That would be great. We do not know what waits below. So we need to be ready for anything. But I know I'll be okay with you, Link. Let's go solve this mystery. Let's do it. I pull out my sword. Ken. So we still have the Master Sword. All our heart containers. Yeah, the graphics are crazy. I can run, I'm just trying to be a little cinematic here and keep keep myself with Zelda. But the sword's out. Sword's out, guys, I'm ready. I'll lead the way. <laughs> the master sword. Oh, it's glowing. Must be sensing something. You can't start with this. That's what it's saying. I knew we had reason for concern. Ever since the end of the calamity, the castle has fallen into neglect. Hmm. But I never could have imagined anything like these tunnels were hiding here. Huh? We must be careful as we move in deeper. Yeah, it feels like Christmas. It's friggin' amazing. This is great. We're going through all this together. It's awesome. All right, speed run. Let's go. Sorry. These are the ruins from an ancient civilization. Wait, something is written here. Might these ruins be from the Zonai? What is that? Is that something I should know about? Uh, the in-game talking for Zelda games is always minimal, yeah. Thank God Link doesn't talk. Let's just keep it that way. Yeah, same, Jeff. I don't want to 
Because yeah, everything gets ruined, right? These carvings, I'm sure they're Zonai and Origin. Zonai, is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, Zonai and Origin. I've seen design designs like this in my studies. The Zonai are said to have lived long ago, in the time of the earliest legend. They possessed godlike powers. Oh, they possessed godlike powers and had uh, civilization in the sky. So is this like another like another group of people that lived way before Link's first adventure. They're introducing something new. Is that what's going on here? Many history books tell us about the Zonai, but none gives us the full picture. Much is still unknown about them, so I'm guessing, yeah, this is something brand new. <coughs> it doesn't sound familiar to me anyway. The Zonai are a mysterious tribe that inhabits Hyrule thousands of years before the time of Breath of the Wild. Okay, thank you. Oh, look at the Master Sword. It looks so badass. Look at it. Oh. It's like glowing. We still have the, the Sheikah Slate. My dogs are going crazy. <laughs> this is what the Zonai look like. They seem so different than us. Large ears. How did the ruins of civilization in the sky end up here beneath the castle? Then got a lightsaber. I don't know. Maybe he's a Star Wars fanboy. Looks like the path ahead goes even deeper. Let's continue, Link. I like this. A nice slow start. Um, I mean, you can play around with the buttons. I don't think I can swing. Oh, yeah, I can. There we go. I'm assuming it's going to be the same controls as Breath of the Wild. My sword breaks, I'm telling you right now, I'm riding. Uh-oh. Yeah, the build-up's great. Uh, what's, what's going on? Oh, enemies? Bad guys? Bad guys, eat it. You are not hurt. Yeah, the are coloring's nice. I like Link's blue, the blue look, the tunic. I always thought it was cool. Look at these murals. The written histories of the royal family include stories of a great war fought long ago. It was a conflict between allied tribes and someone only ever referred to as the Demon King. Do you wonder who that is? Is it possible? Do these murals depict the same legend? Demon King. <laughs> is it like Ganon's boss, maybe? That'd be cool. This is similar <coughs> to the Excuse statues me. we saw earlier. A Zonai. And these figures... Look like Hylians. This depiction certainly suggests that the Zonai descended from the heavens. Oh. It is said that my ancestors, the first of Hyrule's royal family, were born from a union with gods who had descended from the heavens. These murals tell a similar story, and if they are accurate, then the gods mentioned were the Zonai. They must have forged a relationship with the Hylians of that time, working together to establish the kingdom of Hyrule. This figure, he seems to be stealing something of incredible power. Look, from the it's young like kids. they really don't know who that is. With what I've read during my studies. <sighs> it's Ganon, it dummy. It shows the Demon King. Sorry. And a fierce battle against him. <clears throat> <coughs> if the creature depicted here really does represent <laughs> the Demon King, then. Hey, Mo. Welcome. Oh. 
incredible. What was the Master Sword going for? This mural must be the Great War recorded in the royal histories. This is the imprisoning war and the events that led up to it. Link, this is a huge discovery. <laughs> All right then. Now to use this invention of Pura's. I'm glad now we have I to take a selfie. Behind. It's so easy to record. You point it and click. Oh. Oh, it looks like the rest of the murals are obscured. Just what is this place? Maybe we'll find more answers farther ahead. Link, let's keep moving deeper. If they didn't have Ganon, though, do you think everyone would freak out? And Nintendo is a company that I don't want to say they don't care, but they're going to do what they got to do to serve the story, which is great about them. But don't you think everyone would freak out if it wasn't Ganon? I, w I wouldn't. Um, it looks like we might see what Ganon's higher up. I don't know. But that picture on the wall looked like Ganon for sure. Uh oh. We got some uh, red demon dust going on here. That's why he's attack. Okay. It's nothing. Oh, Majora's Mask, I'd lose it. That would be so cool. Oh, no, no, don't beat Spider-Man. Keep going. Catch up. There you go. Wow, I wonder... I'm thinking of speedrunners right now. Like, I wonder if you'll be able to skip this part. Like, this will be, this will be pretty rough for speedrunners. Having to, like, go through this. There's going to have to be a way to skip this intro part. Oh, man, we're really dropping. Look at this. The music is starting to swell. There's a lot of this dust. I'm just going ahead. I'll protect us. Whoa. Yeah, it looks like ash. What is this place? Let's continue, Link. But we must be extremely careful. Okay. That yeah, music's awesome. What is that? What is it? Whoa. That's wicked. Oh, what the? Is that claw? Uh oh. Ah, there goes the sweethearts, guys. <laughs> I knew it was too good to be true. Damn it. And there goes the master sword, guys. I knew it was too good to be true again. Link. Ah. Is that the sword that seals the darkness? Damn it. The blade that shatters so easily against my power cannot save you from me. You son of a bitch. That fragile sword, a link. Raru placed his faith in you, and that was all you could do. How do you know our names? Oh, 
Uh oh. Well, the world was good for about 10 minutes. But now, not. is near again oh uh get her This is freaking awesome. We haven't even done anything yet. This is like so great. Poor Hyrule. The poor people of Hyrule. Yeah, this is pretty, pretty great so far. It's the power glove. Oh my God, does Link have the power of Lucas right now? He does. <gasps> that is amazing. And he looks like Anakin. From the Clone Wars. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Of course. Well, they're not going to start us with everything, right? We have nothing again. Back to sticks for you, buddy. Link, finally you wake. I've heard a great deal about you from Zelda. <coughs> Your wounds were severe. I am relieved to see you escape death. Your arm, however, was beyond saving. I had to replace it, lest the injury endanger you further. Wow, his arm's like destroyed. That's crazy. And he's got kind of long hair. I like it. It looks longer. Hey, Master Sword. Look at his hair. Look how long his hair is. I love it. The game, what's going on? Nintendo is still pushing the Power Glove. <laughs> Go on eBay right now. The Power Glove is probably shot up like 20 bucks. The power of Lucas Barnum. Fused with the link. Oh no. The Master Sword. It's, I'm supposed to be unbreakable. Decayed Master Sword. The sword that seals the darkness. Its sacred power has been diminished after being ravaged by the gloom beneath Hyrule Castle. Once again, none of this would have happened if we didn't go mucking around where we shouldn't have been. No, we had to go to the catacombs and start looking around. And now look what's happened. We got a dirty old sword and I'm naked. Why am I naked? Can I ask you guys a question? Why am I naked? What happened to my, like, sweet blue tunic? It's gone. <gasps> well... 
Here I am. I am na I am Link, and I am naked. That's fine. Let's go over here. Let's explore. Dun, 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 dun. Get up there. You guys know I'm always exploring in all my games before I go into the next area. I like to hide little things, you know? I like to start the game off with, like, something cool. So, do we not have the Sheikah Slate in this one? I can throw. I'm just messing with the buttons here. Yeah. <laughs> Darth Blaze, what's going on? I haven't beat Breath of the Wild either. I wasn't a huge fan of it. I know, surprised, right? But I'll always try a new Zelda. There's just a few issues that, um, for me, they didn't break the game, but it just made it unenjoyable for myself. But I've stayed away from everything with this, so we're going to see if they've improved some of that stuff. Okay, I know we got to touch that green thing. Let's go up these stairs here. So this will be the exit. Okay. This will teach us how to play, probably. Thanks for uh, hanging out. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, it's Savage Link. Yeah, it's very cool. Brandon, what's going on? Yeah, I mean, it's a, it wasn't a bad... Breath of the Wild's not a bad game at all. I just... I didn't like the weapons uh, breaking. Especially when I had all the amiibos. I borrowed my buddy's amiibos and I was getting all the cool weapons. And you're, you, you, you kind of go through it and you're afraid to use them because they'll break. So I found myself just saving all these weapons up. I don't know. I don't like that. If you could repair the weapons, I know you could some of the, the main weapons. But if you could repair them, I'd be okay. Like Fallout style. I just didn't like... Uh, that's the main complaint I had. <laughs> Savage Link. So what do we think of the graphics so far? Notice any major differences? It's definitely on par with Breath of the Wild for sure. Man, it fe like it feels like a freaking cartoon. <laughs> like it's crazy. Like a living cartoon. What's up, Johnny? What's going on, brother? Uh, it feels great. It feels very similar to <laughs> Breath of the Wild. Literally just started the gameplay. What does that say? Landing in water, even from a great height, will prevent you from taking full damage. Okay. That's good to know. This is obviously the tutorial part. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure the mist is a design choice. I'm sure it's not a graphical limitation. Oh, there we go. Look, there we go. There we go. There's the light at the end of the tunnel. We're about to enter friggin' paradise. Are we ready? Are we ready? Ghetto Finger, good morning, my friend. Oh, I don't want any legwear. I want to be naked, boy. Open, let's go. There's our pantalonians. Let's put those on. Uh, 
Oh, it's not even like what's the difference? Oh, it's just like covering the underwear. I like it. I like his savage look. Well, I have like a skirt. I have like a. Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, are we ready? Here we go. Our first look into the world of Tears of the Kingdom. Oh. Um, wow. Look at this. Jump. Where the hell are we? We're above Hyrule? Oh my god. Jump, what are you, crazy? I don't have that bird thing. I need the Joe Glider. Okay, well, here we go. Yeah, I'm just... Wow. So I'm not controlling this, by the way? Aim for the water. <laughs> I can't control him! Savage Link, he just does whatever he wants. Me too, cutthroat. Oh, look at that. So wicked. Oh my god, I love it. Goosebumps. Goosebumps. And there's your water. Belly flop. Dead. <laughs> Ah, well, that was a lovely fall. Let me, can I even look up that high? So I wonder, like, if that was cinematic or that was actual real time falling from that height. Huh. You know what's great right now? Okay. That there's nothing on the screen. They're not. There's. They're not saying a damn thing. What do we do? Well, you get to do whatever you want. So let's get off this lily pad. And go to the edge here. Your swim. Well, if he doesn't get a shirt soon, he's going to get a tan. So he'll be like super tanned buff Savage Link. Look at that. Oh, man. Look at the sun. Wow. It's pretty emotional. Like, it, f it just feels crazy. Like, a new Zelda game. It's insane. Oh, Darth Place. Not a problem. Yeah. Uh, happy you're here. I'm good. I could uh, bring that back out in you. That's awesome. Select weapon. Hold the D-pad. Okay. Okay. I'm a little nervous. Little little nervous here. Because we have the tree branch. Okay. So if the tree branch breaks, I'm fine with that. I don't care. I get it. It's a tree branch. I'm talking about weapons that we find in dungeons or around the world here. If we get, like, a cool spear or something. Like, something that's, like, leet. I'm not just talking about, like, white level spear, like, in WoW. Like, I'm talking about not a common thing. That's when I'm going to lose it. So, hopefully that doesn't happen. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Get out of here. Any attack causes weapons to break. Comes a critical hit, dealing two damage. Where's my sword? There we go. Okay, so we have the master sword. Master sword is running low on energy. Okay, so 
So you gotta charge it up like the other one. What was that? Like some kind of weird droid. I'll take it. A material used to power a source of constructs and other devices. A strange light seems to reveal potent energy inside. That tree branch didn't last long, did it? <coughs> so the Master Sword is blinking pink. Yeah, I was going to say, Scott, that's something from like Black Hole or something coming at us. Oh my, we're not even on Hyrule. Or in Hyrule. Where the hell are we? Is this like Skyward Sword territory? Like even if we fall down there, this is not even the world. Oh my god, this game is going to be gigantic. Look at this. We have a map. And again, guys, I'm going to just take I'm taking my time here, okay? If there's something that you want me to try or do, just let me know. Um, but obviously we want to enjoy this, right? We're not going to get another one for another six years, right? So I'm not going to be speeding through this anytime soon. Oh, never mind. I got the wooden stick. We're speeding through it. Let's equip that. Uh, where's my status screen? Materials. <coughs> Weapons. Armor. Okay. Okay. Exactly, Brandon. Got to savor it. And I really feel like <coughs> you're really in this living, breathing world. Like, it's it's hard to explain. Like, everything feels alive. And the graphics are so crazy. does look awesome so far. Yeah. Hi. How are you? Do you want to hang out or? Link, I've waited for you. Princess Zelda left something for you in my care. Ah, it's my iPhone. Thank God. Purapad, they changed the name of it. I'm told it's an invaluable tool that will provide you with direction. Okay, that's good. It's the upgraded iPhone. Exactly, Jeff. Am I pronouncing that right? Pura? Pura pad? It's like Pura pad to me. Princess Zelda prize device it has. Oh, so I have Zelda's cell phone. TJ, it's clearly a switch. Well, yeah, absolutely. Here we go. There's my map. That's why I can bring up a map before. This is Great Sky Island. Wow. So again... Hyrule will be below us. Find Princess Zelda. There's our marker. She fell into a pit. Like, is she okay? Or? Yeah. I, I do remember hearing, like, long ago, don't quote me on this, that the land of Hyrule from Breath of the Wild returns. And this is kind of an extra. Do you, know, do you know what I mean? Does that make sense? So this is obviously above Hyrule. Obviously, they're going to change some things of on Hyrule as well. But that's kind of what I, I read like long ago when they started developing it. There was a Skyward uh, component to the game. 
I receive it from Princess Zelda, and I pass it on to you. My records indicate that Princess Zelda is waiting at the location marked in the map. She fell in the pit. I'm glad she's okay, but my message has been delivered. I have one option. Where am I? Thank you for not making Link talk. I appreciate that. We stand in the Garden of Time. The Temple of Time is visible from here. It was used in the distant past. Many rites and ceremonies of the kingdom were held here. But no more. Now it's a lonely place. No one visits. Is who nude? Find Princess Zelda. The droid? Is that what you mean? Another branch. Uh oh. A common mushroom that grows near trees <laughs> in Sky Islands. Eat it to restore health. You friggin' eat it. All right, maybe I'll have some. I'm going to put this fungus in my mouth. At least put it on a pizza or something. Nah, just shove these fungi in your mouth. You'll be fine. Ooh, a bridge. Connecting bridge. That's good. The Dalek Slinky Combo. I would agree. Don't worry, guys. Ganon's no match for me. I have this piece of wood. This driftwood will protect us. You know what? I'm not wearing a shirt for the rest of the friggin' adventure. I'm keeping Link shirtless. I like it. Anki looks badass. Like He-Man style. With Anakin's arm. And he's got like some cool rocker hair. I don't know. I love this look. Do you guys like this? He looks so friggin' cool. I do like how they changed him up. Strange light seems to reveal potent energy inside. Uh, okay, can I... Master Sword is not charged. Maybe this thing charges it. Master Sword is running low on energy. Hmm. I'm going to switch from stick to tree branch. Okay, we ran across here. Let's examine all these areas here. Nope. Link continuing to destroy pottery for no reason. An apple. Thank you very much. Nope. Another wooden stick. Uh oh. Hello. You seem to be new here. What kind of voice should that guy have? Do you intend to use that as a weapon against the soldier constructs? Uh, what? Those of us given strict orders to protect the land. The Zonai who created us directed them to eliminate trespassers. They will consider you a trespasser. You must treat them as a serious threat. And it's crucial to maintain the proper distance and target your opponents when singing haphazardly, when swinging haphazardly. Uh, so that's your targets, your lock on. Okay. Let me practice targeting on me if you want. Well, please do not actually attack. He's such a nice little droid. But please don't do it. Okay, let's practice on him. But I won't swing. Ish. All right, punk. There we go. So your typical Zelda Z targeting is right here. Real easy. Okay. Done. No, I think uh, an action figure of this Link is absolutely a friggin' great idea. 
I just like it's different. I think Link should look different in every single adventure. I don't think there's anything wrong with him. Obviously, he's not going to look like this for long, right? This is the starting off Link. But the friggin' arm is cool. Kind of looks like mine. Okay, so here's another jumping point. I guess we're just going to jump. Let me look at the map before we... Before we just give her the old jump off. Uh... There's obviously going to be a way to get back up here. Guys, this is crazy. Look at this. Look how far we have to go just to even meet Zelda. To quote Mr. Roth, uh, heck, might as well jump. Jump! Uh-oh. God, I don't have a parachute! Oh my God, I thought I was dead. It's okay. I made it. I'm good. Hey, a frog. Come here, mister. Oh, look at the mist. No, this isn't a tech demo. I promise I'm going to play. I'm just, like, blown away by it. The same climbing and jumping mechanics as the other game. <laughs> My tree branch is badly damaged. I didn't even do anything. Oh, no, guys. No, it starts already. What's that? Who's there? Hey, don't. Don't. Even, you want to go me? Come on. I just want to be friends. Hang on. Hang on. Whoa. Let's be friends. All right. Well, you asked for it. Tree branch. And now I got nothing. Don't worry. I got another one. Wooden stick. How about badass battle axe? That would be cool to find. Let's just run around. Let's explore. Sky rule. Get it? Hey, birdie. Get What do you guys think of the detached islands? I don't know. I don't quite know what I think of that yet. I'm praying to the Nintendo gods, to Mr. Miyamoto, please, please make the dungeons awesome. Please put more of the traditional Zelda weapons in this game. I'm begging you. Of course, it's too late now because the game's already out, but that's besides the point. I want my hook shot. More shrooms. Give me. Oh, God. I'm afraid of heights. Look at this. Oh, my God. Ooh. <laughs> We're gonna keep heading towards Zelda on the marker there. What's that? Oh, apples. Hey, a fire. Hey, we can cook. Oh! Never mind, there's a bad guy. He saw us. Come on, buddy. You wanna go? I'm trying to figure out how to jump. There we go. That's what I wanted. Ouch. I'm almost dead. I'm dead. I should have healed. Well, there's one death. One down. 800 more to go. You have to start from the beginning.
Yeah. I should have healed for sure. I'm going to check. I'm pretty sure we can pause combat with the menu. Where's the Hadouken? <laughs> You know what would be cool too is like a hat. Although I do like his hair like this. Okay, let's keep going to where we were. Ellie flop. Oh. That's one hell of a splash you got going there, Link. There was an apple tree back there. Okay. Well, too late for that now. Probably should avoid enemies. What, what are these things? Like, what does this do? Sort drop back. Uh, we don't know yet. Okay. Where's Zelda on the map? She's this way. The Hadouken would be great. And I could go for some cutoff, like, I could go for a cutoff gi. I think that would be a cool look as well for Link. I really dig the uh, the arm, though. The arm is great. We're coming, Zelda! Oh, God. I don't want to fight. Get away from me. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, you already whacked me in the eyes. I'm running. Why wow, he's quick. Stop following me. Go away. These, I'm sure, we're going to be able to sell or something, right? Okay, I keep pressing the wrong button to jump. That's what I was trying to do is my fancy flip when I was fighting there. Another guy, these guys are right on me. Let's go. You want to go with me too? Let's go. You'll never know my karate skills. I played Elden Ring for five seconds. Unstoppable. I'm unstoppable. Uh, I'm dominating the dojo. Oh, look at that. Oh, stairway to heaven. Here we go. Stick and move, Max. Stick and move. Do I don't even want, like, JT, I don't even want the Master Sword. You just keep it. I don't even need it. I have this stick. Actually, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This stick is, uh... Hasn't broke yet. Am I jinxing it, guys? Should I just shush? Find some apples. I can't. I'm too excited.
right, I should have found some apples. Uh oh, the stick is damaged. Never mind. Flurry rush. Sticks broke. Great. Well, don't worry. I got three more. Plus, I got a tree branch. A sword. Oh, the sword blew up. Pretty sure I grabbed that. Wild Turkey, what's going on, Thor? The early years. Yeah, we were seeing Anakin. A little bit of Anakin Skywalker from Clone Wars. Why is this Skylanders? I'm just curious. I guess if I had the amiibo, which I don't have the new amiibo. No, the sword blew up. What? The sword's there. Okay, I'm going back. Is it really? No, I don't see it. I guess they think I'm not ready for the sword yet. I'm a club kind of guy with this look, I think. Skylanders, eh? I get... Oh, yeah, okay. I see what you guys mean. With the sectioned off areas, right? Because we're in the sky. There's no, like, grand land right now. Everything's separated. Yeah, I can kind of see that. For sure. <laughs> A little bit, Wild Turkey, yeah. That door will open only to those with sufficient power. Did it? I didn't even notice that, Kim. I'm sorry. I did not intend to startle you. Who's that? It was I that spoke to you earlier. It's the arm. The arm originally belonged to me. Huh? <gasps> Goat boy. Raru. Raru. They want you to have names that you can't say. Forgive me for appearing to you in this manner. Unfortunately, I no longer have a physical form. <laughs> In any case, that arm should allow you to open this door. Skylanders is freaking great. Seems Reminds me of Banjo a lot. So. You might be able to restore it, but you would need to enter a place filled with sacred light. Course. Why not visit the shrines on this island? This looks familiar. The shrines. Yes, I'm sure they are the key. So we're going to have to do the four shrines again, like the first one, before we get to open up the rest of the world, I'm guessing. Which is fine. This is Nintendo's way of giving you a tutorial. It's not boring, right? You get to play through it. The closed door. Kilted Corgi, welcome. Yeah, this is brand new. Hours old, as a matter of fact. Can I? Oh, I can mark like I can in the last game. Okay. So we ch we could just physically see where it is right now. So it's that egg thing. I think we can kind of guesstimate on the map and put a pin down so we can go there via the map. Like, just follow it, but I'd rather just do it this way. Let's do it the hard way. Why do it the easy way? Can I? Am I going to get hurt? Oh, God. 
Now, they said you can jump into water from any heights and you won't get hurt. Uh, I don't trust it. All right, buddy. We'll see you tonight. Thanks for hanging out, dude. <clears throat> yeah, I think you're right, Cutthroat. I need some kind of help. Oh, I have mushrooms. So let me see. I think those heal you. They have to. What else would they do, right? Uh, or do you have to cook it to eat it? Drop sort. Drop. It's not letting me eat it. Probably have to cook it, right? Sky shrooms. <laughs> oh, that's a, a voice actor you recognize. Oh, that's cool. Go to the inventory. Oh, yeah, right. Thanks, Retro. There you go. Eat. So yeah, so when you're in combat, you can't just pop it in your mouth on the fly. Spire where you left. Yeah, you can you can just eat it raw. Okay, you just have to go to inventory. Did we lose it already? It's over there. It's right up there. Wow, how do you get over there? How the heck do you get over there? Well, I guess we got to figure it out, don't we? <laughs> if I start hallucinating, oh, it's your fault. You told me to eat it. Cutthroat said, you know, just be rig. Oh, wait. What's that little bridge thing there? Cutthroat said, uh, just have an apple. But no, I had to have the mushroom. Climb down. What are you, nuts? some kind of a, a bridge. Let's go over there. There we go. Don't worry, I can take this guy. Hopefully he'll drop a bow. Oh, he did drop a bow. Wooden bow from the olden days. Built for hunting. But it's not very powerful. Okay, we have the olden bow. The old, old-timey bow. It's over there. Interesting combat move. Why I keep thinking Y is X, but that's okay. You don't have any arrows. Left. That explains why I pulled the bow and I was shooting and nothing was happening. I was shooting blanks. Oh my God! You and the apples, buddy. All right. Let me know if you let me know if you see them. I'm going to keep going up here. I appreciate you wanting to keep me, like, happy and healthy. But it's all these mushrooms everywhere. Look at this. They just want me to eat shrooms all day. That's what she said. <laughs> ah, the stamina bar. 
We got shrooms. We're good, buddy. We're good. Don't you worry. You get sick from them? Really? Oh, man. I don't like heights either. really want to know what that uh, little bridge thing is. Right there. Uh, those little bridge things, whatever those are going to be, that reminds me of um, Bioshock Infinite big time. Oh my god, as much as I love that game, it used to make me so dizzy. Being afraid of heights, um, Bioshock Infinite is not, not a good game for you. Oh, here we are. We made it to the egg. Oh, I keep running past the apples, yeah. I'm, I'm overstimulated right now with the environment, so yeah. But I got healing agents. I have shrooms. It's all good. So these are the shrines, I guess. Wait, what's that? What is that? Oh my god, look at that. In the sky. Oh. <laughs> How wicked is that? That thing is going to be huge. Wow. All right. In here, let's go. Let's see if skydiving. Our first little shrine. This is nice. Oh. So, you've made it so this far. This is the Shrine of Light, long ago. I filled these places with light that purges evil. I believe the light will restore an ability your right arm has lost. Mm -hmm. Now then, extend your hand. Why? Give me <laughs> the power of Lucas Barnum. Grab and move objects, rotate them. So this is like the Sheikah Slate. I wonder why they changed it. I guess just to change it up. Duh, that's why they changed it. <laughs> mm. This is the Ultra Hand ability. That's what she said. It allows you to move objects freely. All right, Destro. Have a good day, brother. We'll see you in a bit. With it, you'll be able to build a great number of things. Really, anything you can imagine. Mm. Oh, the Ultra Hand! The Ultra Hand. Do you guys know what the Ultra Hand is? The Nintendo Ultra Hand? Google it. That's pretty sick. They called it the Ultra Hand. That's wicked. Well, we can thank our lucky stars, Jeff, that this is not the uh, Wii generation because we'd be getting that. I don't know if I want that again. Okay, I'm just going to check behind here. It's the Master Sword. No, just kidding. This is the Ultra Hand ability. Exact same as the Sheikah Slate. Uh, rotate with R. Drop it. Oh, 
That's not rotating it. I guess it's game over. <clears throat> Why does it keep saying rotate hold R? I'm holding R and it's pulling out my bow. See the Ultra Hand by Nintendo, remember that? That thing's worth like a fortune. I've never seen one before. It's like a toy Nintendo made. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out the buttons. There's there's a lot of there's a lot of buttons in this game. So we got three panels here. Okay. So what are we, what are we doing here? What are we what are we doing? Why does it keep saying R? Okay, that's R. Let me rotate it. God, you know what I'm terrible at? Shapes. So I see what they're saying now. We can build any kind of thing. So we have to build like a table. Right? And R rotates it. Okay, now that we just take the whole thing. Go over here. Not gonna work. Oh no, no, don't tip. Don't tip. It's not gonna work. I don't know how to rotate it. Keep saying hold R. I'm moving the analog and it's just moving it side to side. There's something I'm missing here. I know. I know to pivot. I'm trying to flip it the other way like a table. Right? So. Okay. I picked it up. See how it says on the bottom, it says rotate, hold R. The mistake. Okay, so part of the problem, unfortunately, is my overlay. <laughs> it was is covering, like, the instructions. So if I look here for a second, this has no overlays, this monitor here.
There we go. Wow, it's just a little, a little confusing at first. What am I making? Look at this thing. What is this thing? Doesn't have to be a table. I'm just playing around with it. <coughs> no, I don't think you need to. I'm using a pro controller. I don't think you have to. I know there's motion controls in it, but. <laughs> Not going to work. It's not gonna work, really? Why does this not work? Get up there. You're almost up there. Get him. Get up. Just get. So. Stop saying I don't have any arrows. I realize that. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do with the table, right? Hey, you guys can laugh. It's all good. It's all good. But the controls are it's it's a lot right now. It's a lot for me. I'm not I'm not good with shapes. Right? Never been good with shapes. That's why I'm so I'm like terrible at like Tetris and stuff like that. Let me put this back up. The top. Can't. So that's like stuck there now. What's up, Joe? I don't have any arrows left. Yeah, I know. Just trying to learn all the buttons. Mm. Okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. Okay, here we go. I don't got it. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Now we're going to make our table like I was going to do before. Okay, right, here we go. Boom. Now, hopefully we can pick this thing up and flip it. Let's hope this will work. This should work, right? Should be able to jump up here. What? Why can't I jump on that? Yeah, I could just do an end to end. That's a good idea. I'm going to try this one more time because like, I my table idea was like the best thing ever. Okay. Why he didn't get up there. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I will. Lay them all flat. Say goodbye to the RIP table. I mean, I guess goodbye. Like, 
It's a great idea, but it's the end of it. It's the end of the table. I liked my table. I thought my table was good. You guys didn't think it was good? That was a good idea. He should have definitely grabbed onto that. He should have. Oh my god, this is brutal. Let's drop it. That should be enough, right? Or do you think we need to attach the other one? Should we attach the other one? Yeah, let's do that. Just to be safe. Now this whole thing should go across. You're repping my shirt at work. Dude, that's amazing. For real? Hey, what's going on, man? Thank you very much. Hopefully the shirt turned out great. Uh, it's crazy, right? The times we live in not being able to actually see the merch, right? But I uh, appreciate that, dude. And thank you for the super chat. Very kind of you. Hope you're having a good day at work. Uh, cutthroat, you're right. I mean, I, I, I tried to make that... Um, I guess way more complicated than it had to be. I thought I would be able to grab the edge and like Assassin's Creed it, but this was not the case. Sonic could have made the jump, you're right. And that's what I get. That's what I get for, uh, you know, giving Sonic the B tier, I guess. Nintendo's like, we'll show this guy. What was that shadow? Oh my god, look at this place. What is this? It's gotta be some intricate travel system, right? Oh, thanks, buddy. Thanks again for the super chat. You have a good weekend, man. Platforms up there. Okay, so we gotta put the platform on here, and then how are we gonna get on there? Three D is kind of strange. Okay, that's not gonna work. Maybe the wood flat attached the hooks to it, put it on the cable. Ah. Oh my God, guys. This is like uh, Banjo-Kazooie nuts and bolts. I didn't realize we're gonna be building, like <laughs> I had to have an engineering degree to play Zelda. Woo, I'm sweating from doing this uh, for real. Oh my god, this is, yeah. Hooks the wrong way, Bartlett. There you go, buddy. There you go, buddy, old pal. Attach. Attach. <laughs> detach, detach, detach. How do I get it flat? so hard to tell 
No depth perception. There we go. Attach. <sighs> okay, we got one. We got one. <sighs> Where's the second one? Oh, there it is. Come here. Hey. Get over here, thing. What are you doing? Gonna turn the hook which way? Rotate it. I don't know if I built it right though. We yeah, let's try it. Oh yeah. Or I can see it. All right. I didn't build it the right way. Look at this. This, this is not going to work. <laughs> what am I doing? Watch this. Watch this. Is this going to work? <laughs> I know. I know what we got to do. I'm just having fun here. There we go. And perfect. Perfect. Look, look at it. Look at it. <laughs> no. We need two hooks, though, right? We're going to need two hooks. C for design. Yeah, I'm terrible at this. Don't we need two of these to attach it? Oh, wait. Can we pull this? Don't we need two of these, though, right? Yeah, this is uh, this is a little crazy. This is a little steep. I'm not good at puzzle games. I don't like clearly. So to have this to be the first thing, you have to attach from the ball part. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying here. This, this, this is not easy, guys. Well, it's not easy for me. See, it's like lighting the whole thing up. Uh, can you put the one you have right in the middle of the base down on the board? Yeah. I'm going to have to do that because the other one's not coming up. I detached it. Detach. Okay. Oh my god, I do not I do not like this mechanic. I do not like it. I'm just being honest here. I can't figure out the shapes and the way to rotate it. Whew. Getting itchy, I'm already getting itchy. Detach, but it's not gonna Understand. So if you go over here, I don't I don't know, I don't know what I'm doing wrong here, so right? Was I grabbing the whole thing? Maybe I have to grab this. It just grabs the whole thing. Okay? Or if we just grab the hook. doing the same thing okay I definitely need a coffee give me two seconds I need to step step away just for a sec Woo! give me two secs guys yeah it's not it's not fun for, <laughs> for some it might be but this is the kind of this is like I'm just saying right now if you were to make 
my worst nightmare into a video game, it would be stuff like this with shapes and trying to figure it out and rotating them. I'm terrible at it. So we'll see how this goes. Okay, give me a couple minutes. I'm going to grab coffee.
Where's my controller? <clears throat> oh, I don't feel bad. Yeah, thanks, though, for saying that. <clears throat> Part of the game, right? Uh, attach that from that. <coughs> so I think if we just. I've stepped away from it. We just attach the one hook, right? We should be able to. Uh, just trying to think of how this is going to work. Activate that. Right? Now. Just had to step away for a second and get my thinking hat on. <clears throat> now what, I have to power this now? Well, how do you make it go? Oh my god, I'm gonna lose it. Is this not the way? I thought this was the way. Put it on the hook, right? So I'm gonna have to do it over here? Like, is this not the way to do it? Put the hook in the middle of the board. Okay. Okay, so put that down. No, no, come here, come here, come here. Don't you go anywhere. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh, God. Get over here. This is incredibly frustrating. I know that they're teaching you how to do it, and I'm just, I'm not good at it. But I got to say, this is not a good way to start the game for me. Like, can I even get this thing now? Like, this is not a good way to start the game. It's just not. This kind of stuff drives me nuts. If this is what the game is filled with... Guys, I don't know. I know there's two hooks, but I can't figure out how to how to get it off. Like I can't, like it won't, I'm just pulling on it. Like I don't know. Do you know what I mean? I'm not frustrated with you guys at all. I appreciate you guys helping me. I just, this is the kind of thing I literally can't stand in games. Like these perspectives and all that. It's just so bizarre. That's what she said. <laughs> Get on it. Get on it. Oh, my God. Did we do it? What a hell ride. What a hell ride. I never want to play this game again. <laughs> Lost like six viewers. So I'll say before we go any further, okay? I am not good at puzzle games, shapes and stuff like that. Tetris is difficult enough for me because I just I can't figure it out like putting furniture together and stuff I I'm so bad at it because I don't get it. It just doesn't click. So this is extremely difficult for me stuff like this I'm just throwing that out there right now You guys are helping me so I appreciate that very much. I just need my thinking hat on. The old thinking hat. Resident Evil has puzzles, yeah, but not... Uh, well, if you guys remember, too, like a lot of the shape stuff, too, I get stuck on. We have to look it up, right?
Light of Blessing, a crystal that glows with light that purges ancient evil. So again, let's go back to our, our buddies, the speedrunners that I admire so much. Oh, I mean, I mean, imagine just even trying to practice that part just for a speedrun. And again, I'm sure there's going to be lots of people that play this and stuff like that. It's like, oh, okay, I get it. Oh, Willie's been lurking. He's been lurking and he's been laughing. 100%. 100%. hundred percent I don't want any more of these puzzles can I just fight Ganon with my stick I did very well getting through that shrine that's a lie grade F if you visit and complete two more shrines you should be able to open the door to the temple of time oh my god no please god no You might want to mark the shrines. You might want to speed it up a bit because you're dropping viewers quicker than I can count. <laughs> Someone beat this already? Oh, you know what? I believe it. It came out at midnight, right? Yeah. Where are the shrines? Where are we looking? Ninety-four minutes. Wow. There's one way up there. There's the other one. I spy with my little eye. Oh god, I don't want to do any more of these puzzles. I'm scared. That one was like so, it's like baby basic and I couldn't get it. It took 45 years. I don't see the other one. Hey, Ken, what's going on, buddy? Welcome to the stream. Oh, so that's what those things are. We're going to need to use like hooks. Well, at least we kind of know how to do it now. Willie's always laughing. It's all good. It's all good. Can we just jump here? Okay, so we're if we jump down there, I guess we gotta go this way. Alright, let's So be it, whatever. Ninety-four minutes. Well, what was the original game? Remember the original game you did the four shrines? And then you could go down to Hyrule. And I remember people would just jump on the horse and go straight to Ganon after the... You're just basically speed running the four shrines, jumping down and rushing to Ganon. You with the apples, dude. Well, we're off to a slow start, but that's okay. Oh, God. That's it, Willie. You're off the Overwatch team that we haven't played in four months. Now you'll start winning some games. <laughs> the last time we played with someone and we lost like 14 in a row, which never happens. It n literally never happens. It happened. Now all I'm doing is pulling up that slate thing. Let's go. What? Oh, this guy's not a bad guy. Hey, Zero. What's up, dude? Game looks great. Little, little frustrated. <laughs> oh, thanks, brother, for the super chat. I appreciate your support, dude. Uh, you're at work, right? Beautiful day. Beautiful day for driving around, man. Good for you. Hopefully you'll catch the uh, the toy stream tonight if you're not busy. Q 
Okay, Cutthroat says there's apples behind me. Where are these apples you speak of? I don't see any apples. Sit. You passed the time by the fire. No. Oh, you need reading glasses. Your first pair of glasses? I got mine uh, a couple years ago. And now it's like I can't take them off anymore. Awesome, dude. We'll see you tonight, then. Thanks for the super chat, man. Oh, I already talked to this guy. Stop, stop, stop. 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 Talking. Leave me alone. <sighs> so stressed. All right, let's go. It's brutal, man. You're the same as me. I can see far away, no problem. But, um, yeah, trying to uh, read anything or even look at my phone now, it's forget it. And now I just pretty much don't take them off. You know, all the way up, look how far that is. I just let the stick on fire. Willie's probably beat the... He probably is the guy who did it in 94 seconds. He's a wizard, you know. He's the actual wizard. Uh-oh. Temperature is cold. Have I seen this before? So what do we need? Peppers or something? Here's your apples. Happy? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hit that one into next week. There's the apples. There we go. Okay, good. Glad you're happy. We can make shroom and apple pie. Ooh, doesn't that sound great? I'm guessing we have to go to the other shrine first. We're just exploring here. Oh, yeah. Ooh, different kinds of shrooms. And Donard, what's going on? Uh, it's on par right now. Uh, not too far. The puzzle elements are a little bit more tricky for me from my mind uh just rotating shapes and stuff like that i'm not good at uh so far it's good other than that part kind of slowed us down a bit the graphics are gorgeous we're not in high roll yet we're still far high above it so this is just the intro part where we have to do three shrines i'm kind of just running around exploring uh there's a shrine we have to get to but it's in the cold area so we're gonna have to find we have to mix peppers or we're gonna have to get a tunic or something Oh, that's great. Well, I'm glad you're here. Glad you're able to watch at work. Hopefully it makes the time pass for you. This fool. Dumb droid. Bring it on, Dark Souls stuff. Ow. Give me the wood stick. Yes. Now, nah, Willie's good. He's good at games, 100%. I can check kill this thing. Hey, thing, come here. <sighs> Is it the other? Sh we were just at that shrine, right? Amiibo. 
We don't have amiibos right now. I don't have the new amiibo. Did you guys see it? Well, I haven't been out today yet, but... Uh, Indo Nerd, not too sure yet. We're filming soon. July or August, we start to shoot. Uh, what did you get? Oh, you got ultimates at the door. Is that what you said? Yeah. Big Bad Toy Store. Isn't it great when they come? I love it. It's like freaking Christmas. So great. There's your map. R.I.P. <laughs> Died once. Oh, God, it's going to have X's everywhere. the one place on the map so the other one should be over here yeah it's big bad A actually any like if you're waiting on ebay stuff too that's great right i love I just love getting stuff in the mail it never gets old no matter your age it's always great more apples here we go Back. Good luck with that, Retro. Imagine you did it and they actually sent you one. Like, oh my god, someone hasn't responded to this ad for 40 years. And this guy just did it. Wow, send him a Sarge. What are you waiting for? left yeah they should have done that with the classified Sarge I think that would have been really cool not that they oh my god I almost fall not that they don't have enough mail aways as it is or exclusives as it is but I think for Sarge that would have been neat what do you guys think Bring up the slate again. I can't remember. I can't remember how to do it. How are we going to get over there? I guess we're going to run this way. Okay. Oh, yeah. I guess that kind of counts, Mo. Yeah. Yeah, so this detached stuff is, yeah. I'm sure you know what I'm going to say about it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not going to not going to try and give too much of an opinion yet. We just started it. Um Let's see how we're going to get over there. Maybe we could just jump. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can make that, right? What's our spot right here? Am I allowed to climb up here? Wait. Get your full stamina. There we go. Get going. Get going. There we go.
Yeah, I don't know. I don't like the detached islands too much. I'll just say it. I guess because I feel like we haven't really done anything yet. Um, just my first thoughts. I, I just, I miss the old Zelda formula. I, I really do. I guess I should just know that that's gone, right? I don't do it like that anymore. Can't get over there. Are these hot peppers. Yeah, so these that will work for the cold. We gotta find a fire and then we can cook those. the cold area right we're gonna find a fire yeah I mean I don't have any shirts or anything like obviously I'm gonna be freezing La. or do we just eat it Hey, Mr. Me, what's going on? Performance has been good. Tiny bit of frame issue, nothing too too serious. Like I'm not a tech a tech snob, meaning I don't really care anyway. You know, it plays fine. <coughs> it looks gorgeous. Chad, thank you for the super chat, dude. I did not get notification for you going live. It didn't pop up for me. Oh, cool. Rocks and sticks to make maces. Did I get cold resistance there? Like, why Why can I not cook? Well, I'm going to freeze. Yeah, like I'm dying here. Okay, so that's not gonna work. So do I have to find the recipe? Like, <coughs> Well, yeah, I'm losing health in the snow. In the other game, you needed the peppers. Uh, if you didn't have the tunic, you needed the peppers to uh, warm you up but I'm going by the fire and it's not letting me cook it because I don't know any recipe recipes so <coughs> so we're just running around right now <laughs> yeah well he's especially freezing because this one he's got no shirt on Uh, he's got a replacement arm. His arm got severely damaged in the intro. The Master Sword exploded. And uh, one of these old ancient species or whatever it is gave him this like power glove kind of weapon to put on. Basically, it's like the Sheikah Slate from the last game. <clears throat> I'm just trying to figure out where I should go because I can't go to the cold yet. So I guess... We should locate the other shrine. I mean, let's go this way. To here. And 
and then try and cross there. Maybe we'll get something to enable us to cook or get a tunic by then, a cold resistant tunic. The game, the whole game has like this kind of pastel-y look to it. How do you get recipes? I don't know. They literally haven't told me anything. I guess that's part of the charm of the game, right? Because you got to figure all this stuff out. It's open world, so take toasty shrooms, grow mushrooms. The heat brings up the flavor, increases the amount of health. Okay, so can I make something here? No, you need you need recipes, or maybe if I, maybe I have to hold it. It doesn't. What is this arrow? What is this? Oh, if I had the pot, maybe it's the uh, maybe it's because I didn't pull out the pepper. No, I don't want to return. No, no, no. Yeah, that makes sense. I think I remember that now, Retro. So this one doesn't have a pot. So I guess realistically we could have cooked the other ones. I just didn't know how to do it. I don't want to hold this either right now. Uh, I will say this game, this game's got a lot of controls. Like, like <laughs> I'm getting like a little overwhelmed. <clears throat> I got to just step back for a sec. There's a lot of buttons to this. Old man J only loads NES, you know. So, yeah. Uh, did we go up this way yet? See, I keep hitting the friggin' stupid button. Need acorns? Okay. Well, I definitely need uh, something. Yeah, like no joke. Like I'm, I'm just not used to. There's a lot. Like I'm using a pro controller and it's like <clears throat> every single button does something. It's just learning it. And like I say, before I stream something, I usually practice it. So I have the idea of the basic controls, but we're going in this blind. So yeah, it's going to be a little, little rough. Oh yeah, I got to go to the other shrine. So we've been here. Well, it's safe to say, Gim, it's going to be a good mm. investment for you. I don't know too many people that don't like Breath of the Wild. I'm definitely in the minority, right? I'm one who didn't really care for it. <coughs> Capture taken. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so... The one shrine is over here. That means the other one is going to be this way. So let's continue to go this way. Let's delete the stamp. And let's put this stamp here. I'm pretty sure we're going to have to build one of those things again. Is that beta still up, eh? Is it? How is Diablo, by the way? Oh, 
Oh my god, am I gonna die here? Oh god. Guess not. Arrow, just an arrow sitting there. That's pretty cool. And one of these things again. Oh, no. It's okay. We know how to do this now. Right? Right, guys? Right? Now I see what the tutorial was for. See ya, Zero. Have a good afternoon, brother. Thanks for uh, thanks for hanging out for a little bit. No, no. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Stop! Stop it! Stop it! Why is it attaching like? <sighs> this is my nightmare. My nightmare is right here. It has come true. It is Zelda Breath of the Wild. This edition. All right, Indo Nerd. Cheers, Ryan. Thanks for hanging out. Catch you on the next stream. See ya. Oh, now we're down on the wrong side. Okay, get on it. God's sake. Here we go. Surf's up. I don't like this. I don't feel safe. I don't feel safe. I need an adult. I don't feel safe. Holy crap. Now that I know how to do that, that's the best thing ever. That was the best time of my life I ever had. Ah, uh, yeah. Gim in Toronto. Treehouse Collectibles. You'll love it. It's one of my favorite stores on the planet. Hmm. So this guy doesn't even give me anything. Give me something. Give me like a... His, what is that? Stone axe. Okay, we're moving up, guys. Can't carry any more melee weapons. Really? Okay, well. I guess we'll have to get rid of some of these branches. Right? Drop. Cool. Good. Use this to make campfire. Chopping trees. Yeah, well, we're not going to waste the axe. Cutting, sure. Well, I don't really need that tutorial right now. Hey, what is this thing? 
Oh, look at that. You can make boats. Guys, are you seriously, like, I'm supposed to be able to, like, think of making things like this? There's no way. Oh, Kim, like, uh, Chris is the owner there. Just a, such a cool dude. Everything he has in the store, okay, so, yeah, he's got vinyl, by the way, yes. Toys, video games, all that stuff that he has, he doesn't put out until they're complete. So, like, if you're looking for Inhumanoids, for instance, right, he'll, like, gather them over the years, slowly put them together, and when they're all complete, then he'll put them up for sale. He cleans up everything so they look like they're friggin' brand new again. It's just, it's awesome. Crafting, look at this. So we've got logs, a box. Um, and we're going to have to make some stuff. So you know this is not going to go well. You just know it's not going to go well. We need to make a bridge. Well, we made this thing. Maybe we could just break that. Actually, let me see if I can. Oh, logs. Maybe this will work. It's not going to fit, is it? It's too small. Not too small. I can't tell. There's, like, the perception, the angle. It's, it's not going to fit, is it? Yep. Going to say it right off the bat. I don't like this. I don't like this part of it. I don't like this crafting. I don't like this creating things. I don't know. Uh, I'm just being completely honest with you guys here. It's just not my thing. Like, this is, to me, this is not Zelda. Traditionally, it's not. We've had one other Zelda game like this. Um... Yeah, it's too small. I just, I don't like to do this. It's like, there, where's the meat to the, to the game, right? Ah, I just want like a traditional Legend of Zelda game. Like the way, like the reason why we all fell in love with Zelda games. Like I'm all for the open world. But all this like. We have to fashion this to make this and create this to get across. I just, I'm not a fan of that. I know we got to build a bridge with the logs. I'm just, I'm belly aching right now. Attach. I mean, on the plus side, you can make some really cool stuff. Whatever your imagination will allow you to make. What is that? That's highlighting over there. What is that? Hmm. Acorns. Cheers. So can we, let's extend it to here. Okay, this is the best game I've ever played. I changed my mind. Maybe this game will teach me uh, how to get over my uh, learning 
severe learning disability of shapes. And it's, believe me, it's severe. But I understand this is Nintendo teaching you. They can't just throw you into a dungeon, right? And you don't know how to do any of this stuff. I get it. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna move this. It's not done yet. I'm just gonna move it over here. To where she's gonna go. Put that down here. Move this. Come here. Get over here. Get out of my face over here. Yep, it does take a little patience. You're absolutely right. And I'm gonna give this game a chance. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep playing it. I am. We could just do three. Yeah, we don't have to do three across, right? I think Link can do uh, two. Biggest hurdle so far is just remembering what all the buttons do. But that was a problem for me with the last one, too. There's just there's so much to do. Okay, get up there. Get up there. Don't fall. Right, where do we have to go? Still think we need... Um, oh, I keep hitting that wrong button. We still have to find the other shrine, right? So that one's there. I'm guessing that this one's going to be here. I'm going to put a stamp here. Just to remind us where I think we need to go. Arrows. What do you guys think so far? What are your thoughts on the game? Can I use this yet? Well, I have totally broke the Master Sword now. Oh, wow. Like, I, like it's gone. Ah, well. You like it so far? Yeah. Okay, uh, that's still the cold area. I'll grab that thing. I thought the Master Sword would... I didn't think it would, like, explode like it did. Oh, well. That's what you get. Oh, God. I almost died. I was just going to jump off there. Oh, my God. Am I gonna, I'm going to die here. No, I'm not. Can I lift this? I can't lift it when I'm standing on it, right? I don't think I've killed myself here. You're stuck in Code Veronica? What part are you stuck on? Good. It's been a long time, but... Remember, you can find anything on, like, YouTube, too, if you're, like, super stuck. 
Especially for an older game like that. Rip. Creatures with long arms. So they're just killing you? Is that the problem? Weapon, maybe you need a stronger weapon. What is this thing exactly? Let's find out. We can kind of make steps here, I guess. God, try to jump. So this we can just, like I don't know how high we can go here. We'll be able to make that? So we're gonna try, right? I hope he can cling to the side, Spider-Man style, go, okay, here we go, boom. Good job. Good job, Link. Now we're going to use this one. Make our own it's stairs here. Yeah, I think we should be able to make it here. Three would have been easier, I'm sure. Again, I have no idea where we are. Maybe we'll find Majora's Mask in here. There it is, Majora's Mask. It's unbelievable. So this is blue. What does that mean? Was there a blue? Like, look at the axe. There's like a blue tinge around it. That means it's a little bit more durable, I'm guessing? Or does that mean it won't break? Oh, God, please tell me it means it won't break. Oh, the building stuff. I will put that aside, and I won't worry about that. If there's just a hint that some of the weapons will not break. Do you think that's what the blue is? Can somebody Google that? We're looking at the, the blue outline around the weapons. See, these ones don't have it. If you can find out, that would be great, man. Just the blue outline. I just want some of the stuff not to break. Because I'm afraid to try and crack open these boxes because I don't want the axe to break. It's probably going to not be a whole lot online yet. It's tough to say. Okay, so what was it? What was in here? Nothing. Just arrows. Sony charge. Okay, those are going to be used for probably upgrading later. I would assume. That's what was up here. Okay.
Or you can even Google, like, do some weapons. To, does the durability not count for some weapons? Clearly not the Master Sword, because that exploded. That was great. Like, see ya. Uh, where's our steps that we made over here? This way. It's gotta be this way. Whoa. Arrow fight. Friggin' go, buddy. Wild plant fruits often found in cooler climates contains nutrients that increase endurance. Weapons stronger with fuse, okay? Cut through. It's just the number of weapons, the higher the number of strength for your weapons. Yeah, so that's just the, uh, well, there's a sword. Yeah, so the, the five means, like, that's the damage of it, right? Um, but you see what I mean, where look at all the weapons here and see the axe has the blue aura around it. So that must be what JT's saying. So you can fuse something with that. Yeah, the blue halo. But does but does that still mean that they can be uh, like the durability goes down over time? Rusty broadsword. Look at this thing's terrible. <coughs> Durability is the same last game. Okay. Well, you know what? We got to evolve, right? Not you guys. Me, I should say. I have to evolve. That's just the way Zelda is now. Okay? And I don't like it, but that's the way she is. The dur durability is a thing now. Obviously, we're going to get the Master Sword later. We're going to be able to repair that. Critical headshot. We got a chest. Did you see me building that bridge? Where was friggin' uh, the bridge layer when I needed it? And supposedly you can fuse diamonds for better durability. According to Google, Master Sword has infinite durability. I'm guessing after you fix it again. Yeah, because it exploded on me. Give me something good. Uh, how about a shirt? Where is the like regular RPG level one dirty shirt? Like, I'm going to get, like, sunstroke already. Oh, there's another chest. Oh, that's a guy. Never mind. Well, we got to be close to... That's it right there. There it is right there. And we got to get 
back there. That's the whole thing. Now you got to build a freaking yacht. Good luck with that. Have fun. Fall down there. Now oh, we can jump in the water. So we see the shrine. It's straight ahead. That little island. Um, jump. Yeah. You can fuse the opal to the weapon. Oh, okay. Let's try that. Thanks, dude. Is this opal? Oh, yeah. I'm guessing we have to do it at a certain station, right? Oh, wait. No, you got to hold it, right? Add. He's just holding it. Yeah, there's got to be probably some weapon station that you can do that at, I'm guessing. So I'll just take that out of my hand for now. We got to wor worry about getting off this island. Um, the wind is blowing. I'm guessing this is where we have to make the boat. Just guessing, I don't know. Stamina wise, we're not gonna make we're not gonna make that um swim for sure. Come on, Dark Soul style. Eat it. Give me that big club. Thick stick. <laughs> oh yeah. Where's that thicky? Drop that piece of crap. That. Yeah, give me the thicky. There we go. Big thicky. Yo, you're back. You're free. <laughs> well, son. Is that what is that? Well, son. Ow. Can't use those to make anything. Getting five kids ready for school every day. Oh my god, dude. Side hop, yes. Uh, I think it's like this. Like that. He's got to hold the Z target. Press jump. Good for you for getting five kids ready. Gravity-wise, we're not going to be able to go up, clearly. There's no way we're making that island swim. If this is anything like the last game. Alright, let's go over here. Chop a tree, build a boat. It's a good idea. Um, what would we use for the sails? Because remember we saw the example of that up there. What would we use for the sails? You see anything around here? Cloth wise? Oh, what's this? It's a cloth sail. See now this is a puzzle I can get behind. Don't blow away, don't blow away. Don't you blow away on me. Oh, look at this bootleg boat I made. Man, people are going to have, like, so much fun. People that like to do stuff like this. Like, making, like, wacky contraptions, right? And going, like, to the top of mountains and just, like, launching themselves off. I don't have the glider yet, my friend. Not yet. I'm sure we'll get that after. Sees this rotation crap again. There we go. 
No, stay on right there. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you think this will work? Look at it. You think this piece of crap will work? Should we try it? Should we try this? Let's try it. Oh. <laughs> Get on it. Get on it! Oh no! <laughs> no, my boat! My boat! No, my boat! Damn it! Now I'm gonna drown. I'm gonna drown! Three, two, uh. Oh. You're not supposed to leave without me, boat. Oh, look, it's over there. It's over there. I can't even get it. Oh, I gotta do it again. It's like the first one's free. Here's the axe, too, dummy. Try again. All right, let's try again. Dirty old logs. I'll be going around in circles. Okay. So what you're saying is I've got to do a better job at constructing a boat. Is that what you're saying? All right, I'll try. What was it? You. How dare you attack me? I'm just trying. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm hurt pretty bad. Let's eat this. Help. Help. There's your apples, buddy. They came in handy. And we're going to use... No, no, no. I keep hitting the wrong button. Uh, let's just use this club here. Beat him over the head with it. This is what you guys get. You're going to get this. Work. Oh, it's like a two-hander. Work. Work. Dark Souls style, baby. I'm going to die. You're not going to die. Walk on. Just take her easy. Wait for him to make his dumb move. And whack him in the soul. There we go. I mean, it could have could have gone better. An apple a day. What is more? Oh, there's another one. Back to what I was trying to do. I was just trying to make a nice boat. At least they were nice enough to do the sail. I'm sure later on we're not going to get as lucky. But for now the sail's right there. Uh, stick this to this thing. Is that enough? Oh, I didn't stick it to this one. Do you think the three logger is enough? What do you think? That's good, right? Okay. Oops. Uh, rotate on about this again. On about this again. See, this is where we had problems last time. Okay. Now the front, right? Right here. The center. Center of the sail. Okay. Right here? Hard to tell. Looks like it's right there. There, that's good, right? Looks good, okay. I'm gonna take this stupid thing over here. Now, how am I gonna do this and get on the damn thing? Oh god, this is gonna be embarrassing. Here we go. Let's get on it. So jump is that one. Okay, so can we push this in? <sighs> uh, TJ, how's it going, buddy? It's a giant learning curve for me. 
but it's going better than it was earlier, for <laughs> sure. Oh, I almost didn't make it there. Look at this. We made this with our bare friggin' hands. Naked Link, Barbarian Link, going to the Promised Land. Oh, God. We did it. Oh, no. Don't hit. Don't. No, don't hit those. Don't hit that. Don't hit that. Titanic! Titanic! Oh. I'm out. There's my other boat. <laughs> Look at my other boat there. <laughs> Look at the two longer I did. <laughs> this is the zero effort boat, and then this is the... Uh, like, look, this is how bad I am at stuff like this, right? Let's look at these two boats here. One of them, the sail is not centered. The weight distribution is all over the place. And then the other one is perfect thanks to you guys. <sighs> Jesus, this, I feel like this is like an actual adventure. All right, now where are we going? Get away from me. Well, how many are coming to get me at once? You? Let's go. Bring it, Dark Soul. Got another one on us. Eat it. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> Making that boat is friggin' hilarious. The many ups and downs of the Zelda stream. So now we're on a high note now. I'm not a guy who likes to build things with his hands, you can tell. I'm not a manual labor guy. Oh no. We gotta go into this thing. Now we're gonna have to learn something new. We just figured out how to build a friggin' boat. Now we're gonna have to like do some more weird crane stuff or whatever. Now I wanna do the crane stuff. Can I just fight like Wizro? Please? Give me the hook shot. Let's go. Jay, you're living in the past, man. Well, not really. <laughs> Bodie Mc oh. Bodie Mc what? Bodie Mc boat face. I thought you said Bodie Mc float face. Okay, sorry. So you've made it here. I don't know why he talks like the emperor. Now then, extend your right hand. Uh. Here you go, weird hand. Here's another power that won't irritate you. Is it lightning? Please tell me it's lightning. It's not going to be lightning, is it? Attach something to an equipped weapon or shield to enhance it. This is the best day ever. Dun, dun, dun. You can undo the fusion, but that will destroy whatever has been attached. I don't know. It's just the only voice I feel like doing right now, I guess. Mm. Woo! Gonna be uh, coffee time soon. You like it, Ghetto Finger? It's good, right? I'm slowly. Slowly warming up to it. Slowly. Uh, I've had four so far. Sorry, three. Three. But I've been up since five. I didn't go to any midnight release for this. I wanted to. 
but I didn't. So I just I had bought it digitally. So I wanted to make sure that it was going to be in time, and it took yeah, oh, just over an hour to download it. Ability to combine. Okay. Good. Just don't make me build another Skynet or Skyhook or whatever. Fuse. Ultra Hand. Fuse. Okay. Let's fuse. Let's do this. Well, there's our sword. So we're going to have to drop something. Let's drop this dirty old club. Uh, yeah, what X. Let's drop this one, too. All right, let's learn how to fuse. Rusty Claymore. The old two-hander. Look at this thing. This is like Elden Ring territory here. I have to be careful. I'm going to break it. Put it away. Oh, God. Put it away. There you go. Okay, we got a rock. Okay, we got another rock. Boulder. Rusty Claymore. Water. Oh, my God. Uh <laughs> Um uh, what? The puzzles for me have been difficult. Uh the first tutorial uh ghetto they they show you the first um, ability with the Ultra Hand, which is basically like the Sheikah Slate. Uh, and that's the ability to take two items and kind of make them like I made that raft there. And I'm bad at rotating shapes to fitting them in slots. Like I'm terrible at uh, building furniture or anything like that. And I just it just doesn't work with me. So we we're trying to get this hook attached to a plank so we could sail across and everybody, everyone in chat, God bless you guys for putting up with that. I couldn't figure it out. I, I start to get it now. But I will say for me, this is just for me. I'm no game pro, but for me, it's got a very steep learning curve. But this, but this makes up for it. Look at this thing. What? Yeah, what should we name this? Sword balls. Sword ball. Uh, rock more. Oh, that's good. Clay no more. Yeah, it's way better than rock balls. Hit the door. Yeah, I know. I'm just... We're, we're naming this. TJ, this is your territory. This is like Elden Ring stuff here. What do you want to name this thing? Broad. Meatball on a stick. Let's call it bash, bash door thing. Whoa. Whew. It's going to be uh, feel pretty sweet to hit a bad guy with this thing. Look at this thing. It's ridiculous. The weapon combos you're going to be able to make are crazy. Are these hot peppers? Fire fruit. Fire fruit that generates heat when struck. Cook correctly. It's heating, does improve blood flow, stimulate muscles to raise attack power. Okay, so... Oh, the, 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 the little uh, ball shrinks there. When you put it on your back. Uh, Skyfall says that you're going to rock this game, Jay. See what you did there. I like it. 
Okay, that was the first puzzle. That was pretty easy. Uh, we're just going to explore. Like, is that it? No. Okay. You can make fire arrows with that fruit, yeah. Select materials to attach. There we go. Oh, wow, so we only get one. What is it again? It's. Oh, it's the up button. <laughs> We're gonna have to shoot these things, I think. I'm just guessing. No? Shoot the door. Well, it's gotta be something down here, isn't it? I tried to shoot those two t torch things there. That doesn't do anything. Oh, it's a combo puzzle. Uh, so we gotta switch back to the Ultra Hand. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Shoot that. Which door? Sorry. Like the green door? Like this door right here? Oh, there's a chest up there. Look at that. Hulk smash! I didn't even think that was going to work. Arrows? Give me like a sweet helm. The this green door. Okay. Uh, so let's... Nope. Take out this. And infuse with this. Well, there's something we're missing. It's okay. Oh, what's the vines up there? What is that? Oh, there's a chest way up there. Look at that. I think if we burn this. That was pretty cool. Small key. There you go. We did it. Well, let's take lots of these fruit for sure. Look at this ridiculous sword. This is hilarious. So you know what I want to do? Let's go back. We're having fun, right? We got We got nowhere to go. Let's just have a little bit of fun at this entrance here. With this thing. Okay, now let's let's infuse something else. Um so let's do I don't know, like let's do like tree rock. Do you want to do tree rock? This is even more ridiculous. <laughs> what else do we have? Oh, do you want to do... Look at the <laughs> how stupid that looks. <laughs> it's like literally if you were to go up to a kid and say, like, design me a weapon, it would be something like a little kid would make. I mean, it's cool, but it's funny. Do you know what I mean? I don't think... We, I, I mean, I don't want to wreck the axe. We could do, like, axe, rock, tree, rock. Two at the same time, okay. Well, let's try it. Yeah, let's try the claymore then. Again. Oh my god, we can. Boulder hammer. Oh, wait, what happened? 
fuse has already been used on this. Okay. Well, it was it was worth a try. Yeah, I try I tried to, it didn't it didn't allow it. So it already says we have the boulder hammer and if I press Y here, it says fuse has already been used on that. <coughs> We don't really have anything else. I don't want to ruin the axe because that's all we have to cut down trees. Uh, well, I guess I could make... Well, I could make double club. If you want to make double club, stone club. Thick club, stone club. Let's do that. It's time to make double club. Oops, wrong button. Here we go. This is a deal double hander club stick. Oh, <laughs> how can I even move? It's like a hammer hand from Thundercats. This is hilarious. Boulder Hammer, that's a great name. I feel sorry for whatever goblin's going to feel this. I'm, gonna, I'm going straight to Ganon. Let's go. I'm freaking going right now with boulder hammer oh no no more puzzles please just let me leave that's pretty clever how this stone shrinks uh oh Those are really weak. Listen to him. Is he alright? Link, you gonna be good? He Link. <laughs> oh, okay, it's Stone Rock Guy versus Stone Rock Guy. Oh god. Oh god. I don't play Dark Souls. He's going to be uh, he got. Look at that <laughs> stupid weapon. TJ, you're about to see why I don't play Elden Ring, buddy. Here comes he got. He hammer, that's another good one. He hammer. I don't have to get all this stuff again, do I? No. Good. It's got its ups and downs. Um, I think the game is going to be absolutely enormous. Like, how long have we been playing? Three hours. Uh, this is the tutorial area still. Granted, you know, I was having a little bit of trouble with the puzzles. Like, it's going to be huge. Um, the weapon fusing is really freaking cool. Uh, Imagination-wise. Like, look at this up here. So now, we didn't, now we got staffs and stuff. Long stick. The spikes. How cool is this? No, no, no. I want to switch over. Let's switch to this staff. And uh, then why? Whoa, look at that. 
some stuff I like, Jeff. Some stuff I don't like. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna wait until we get to Hyrule. Uh, I want to do a dungeon before I make any kind of claim. It's very much like Breath of the Wild. Just good and bad. Oops. The the buttons is is a huge learning curve for me. Dun, 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 dun. Ultra combo. He's scared now. He's like, oh man, that sucked. Come on, Infusor, let's go. Oh, now we got a new bow. You got it today, right, Jeff? <clears throat> What's up, Vicman? What's going on, dude? What is that? Captain Construct Horn. A double-edged blade like horn. It's formidable when it comes to slashing. Okay, so can I make something else here? Look at these stupid weapons. Look at this. Look at these things. Dumb rock club thing. Spike dumb stick thing. I mean, this thing's kind of cool, I guess. I shouldn't say it's dumb. It's just I can't get over how hilarious this looks. Look at it. It's so funny. Arrow. Cheers. Arrow. Cheers. I mean, if you can fuse weapons like this and you can actually keep your weapons from breaking as much, that's already an improvement for me. Um, so I'm all for that. <clears throat> it certainly looks like you're going to be able to. At least a little bit. I know, right? Yeah, Scott, that's a good point. This is just the tutorial stuff, so think of all the other things you can fuse together. Uh, I'm really interested to see the Zelda community and what they come up with in terms of vehicles as well. I mean, there's a. This really does remind me of Banjo Nuts and Bolts. It does. I just think that, that that part of the beginning really messed me up. I just... Uh, rotating in the three dimensions and all that. Ugh, brutal. But anyway, enough about that. We're moving on. Is there anything back here? What's that? Master Sword. No, that's nothing. Yeah, you can make planes. That's See, that's pretty cool. Just imagine what some people are going to make. They'll probably make tanks and stuff. Wasn't there a motorbike in Breath of the Wild? Like DLC? We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. What are you giving me? I don't want a shirt. It's too late for that. Give me a hat. I'll take a hat. Oh, God. What did I get? Now we got Corey's power from the wizards. We got Corey and Lucas. Light of blessing. A crystal that glows with the light that purges ancient evil. Huh. Okay. The music is great. Yeah, uh, it would be great if you could poison the weapons. I'm sure you're going to be able to do that. If you can take the uh, like the fire fruit and make fire arrows, I'm sure you're going to be able to make poison. Link, what is that ridiculous thing on your back? Uh, there's, I came because there's something I failed to give you. It's an actual weapon. Please take it. 
What is that? Firecrackers? What is it? Energy cell. Designed to be worn on a belt. To power the device. What? What is it? Okay. In that cave. Okay, sorry. However, I, uh, I have associates on the other side of that cave system. Your weapons, you will not need them. Yeah, right. Okay, well, I guess we're going to the cave. Let's go. Da -da 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 boulder guy. Oh, wait, where? Well, how far is it? I love how they show it, right? And it looks like it's just right there. Okay, so there's the cave. But it's like 3,000 miles away. It's actually not that far. Pro tip, it's not that far. I don't want anything to do with the fighting. Slinky, look, they, yeah, they look, uh, hey, there's a chest right there. No, oh God. Wow, that's cool. Hey, 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 here comes old Boulder Sword to whack in this friggin' teeth. Whack! Whack! Why did that guy die? Well, what's this guy got? This guy's got a fly swatter. Where am I? Run. Oh, oh. Mm. That's what you get for messing with me. Can you set the boulder on fire? Oh, dude, that would be crazy. Let's try it. Uh, how do we do that again? Okay, this. Then... Uh, I don't think so. Maybe? I don't see it, no. Hey, it's the cooking song! Grants a low-level attack, enhancement, and hot places. Like, we haven't even found a town, or like a settlement, or really anything. But we found this chest. Here we go. Master Sword. Du -du -du -du. Hey, that's cool. Soldier Reaper. Well, it's a uh, damage seven. It's already blue. Ah, uh, so the blue means we can. Oh no, you can infuse any weapon. The blue must mean it just doesn't break as easy. It's that's what it's gotta mean. Look at this thing. That's pretty cool. It looks like a Lego weapon. Look at it. It's like a Minecraft sword. And that's really, like, now my mind is just, like, looking. I'm scouring the environment. I'm like, what can I add to this thing? Let's add a boat to it. I bet you can do that. Let's add the boat on the end of the, the knife. Or, the, or, the, or this board. Oh, my God, we can. Dude, this is hilarious. Use the boulder to it. Should we do the board? Uh, what else can we do? I'm sure if we cut down the tree, we can put the log. We can put the board on it. Should we put the board on it? 
the thing is, remember it said once we infuse something, you can't undo it or you'll destroy the weapon. What do you think? Do you think we should do the board? I think they want us to do the board. Excuse me. <coughs> That's why they put the board there. I need a coffee soon, guys. Do you want to see the board or do you want me to just leave it? What about the log? Log from Blamo. Okay, well, let's cut down a tree. Oh, the axe is badly damaged. Okay, so there we go. So because it's outlined in blue does not mean it's indestructible. That's kind of a bummer. But I wonder if we can save it by infusing it. It's big as heavy as what I used to have. Did you guys ever have like a long shirt? I used to have a long shirt. Oh my God, it was like the best thing ever. Okay, you ready? The log? Or we could like infuse the stick to it, the tree branch. Okay, let's do the log. Let's just make it stupid. Here we go. What? Fuse has already been used on this. What are you talking about? Uh Oh yeah, well watch this. I wanna find another tree branch. And then we're gonna what if you take this wood stick and infuse it with this tree branch and make super wooden stick? <laughs> Watch out, Ganon. <laughs> this is like this is something I would do. Like if I was playing this by myself, I would have done this and thought I was really cool for doing it. It's branch stick. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay. Uh, guys want to give me five? I need a coffee big time. I'll leave Link right here. He'll be a good boy. I'll meet you guys back in five minutes, okay? Just grabbing a coffee. <laughs>
If stick durability has five and the boulder has five, would it be ten? Oh, we can find that out. Uh, Scott says, I just thought of a brilliant idea. Once you have the shield, fuse it with one of the boards. Make it bigger and harder for you to take hits. Yeah. So this is great. I, I enjoy the weapon fusing. This is really great. Look what it's done. We're all, like, discussing that right now. OK, 
Okay, so let's try. Okay, so let's do... So this wood stick here, okay. It has a damage of four. Okay. We're going to infuse this log to it. <laughs> and yes, now it's got a, a damage of five. So it does does stack. Look, it's stick log. What does this look like? It looks like a corn dog. All these top heavy weapons are great. So we gotta go we gotta go right. Oh wait, we gotta go in this cave. That's right. <laughs> Discovery. Pondside Cave. That's kinda cool too. What's this? Bright bloom. Get away. Eat my corn dog. Well, what's this? I guess we're probably going to need a pick to mine that, right? Because it's not doing anything. Can't pick it up. Yeah, Link's going to be buff. Oh, what? Look what I did. Look, it's fire, fire torch, corn log dog. Fi it's fire log. Use an eyeball to the stick. Let me take this guy out. No, no, no. Oops. Oh, I threw it away. Oh, God. Arrow right to his soul. What the? Damage. A strange crystal left by defeated... Blue frogs in caves. This eerie blue glow may entice you to collect even more. My brain is just like swelling. Oh god, I don't have anything on me. It's just like swelling with like everything that you can collect and do. It's just like I'm trying to like wrap my head around everything. <laughs> Sorry. You guys know what I meant? A chest. Okay, here we go. The Hylian Shield. One, two, three, go. <gasps> we got a tunic. Oh, I'm going to miss Bear Chest Link. He was once a man. Here we go. 
Let's put it on. Ah, uh, he kind of looks like Perseus from Clash of the Titans. The flame. Where's the flaming corn dog? Here it is. <laughs> it's not on fire anymore. I don't know why. I like a bear shirt or bear chested to be honest. I don't like this thing too much. What's this guy saying? Mm. I gotta be honest. I don't want to learn anymore. I've learned too much. <coughs> what? Oh. What? My stick broke. Can I pick this up? I don't have an axe to break those. Uh. Wait, what is this? Oh, that sword I got was fused with this thing. Wait. Soldier. Okay. I got a stick. I'm looking to fuse. Oh, we can make porcelain pot stick thing. You want to do it? You want to make pot thing? Or what about giant log stick thing? I think the pot's just gonna break. Can we try the, the log or let's try that? Fuse has already been used on it. Oh, what's this thing? Fan? Oh, wait, wait a, wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. They're gonna teach us how to make like a hovercraft or something here. Yeah, I like Savage He-Man Link. I've never fused cereals. Nope. Count Chocula, pure. I love it. The only silver lining is that the Zonai devices are undamaged. The green things are called devices, okay? One you can see here is a fan. If you can produce wind demand by striking it. Oh, so I have batteries. An energy cell stores energy required. Okay, so it powers the vehicles that makes sense <coughs> its energy will replenish automatically well they're not in use okay so we don't have to keep getting batteries they're rechargeable batteries you just plug it in your iphone okay i follow use the energy contained within wisely otherwise you may run out of run out at inappropriate moments So it's just like anything in this game. You can't overuse it or it like will stop working, basically. Okay, so I mean... What, what's this guy stopping me for? I'm not allowed to use this part, so I was going to try and make a hovercraft. You won't let me. I'm going to try again. Nah, you won't let me. They can't be chopped into boards? Okay.
The river it is. Yeah, I think I think you're right. Uh, I don't have an axe to break those crates. Uh, well, we can go this way. Right, we have to get to here. But there's still the cold weather. So hopefully between now and then they give us a cold weather tunic or we get peppers or something. Some of them are better first. You might learn a few things. Wait until you speak with him. Okay, well I did speak with him and he didn't want to give me anything. Oh, there's three of them. I can fix your raft for you. Okay, I think we have to hit the fan. I think that's what we didn't do. What? What is happening? Just keep saying they need to rest. Yeah, and then the other guy says, talk to the, the constructs. They can teach you things. But then I talk to them, and we're just going in circles here. Well, you know what? I would assume that if it's something that I absolutely need. Oh, wait, there's stuff here. There's ones over here. So, so we can build our own, right? I think we just can't use the ones directly in front of them. So let's build a crappy raft. I don't know what the back or the front is. No, that this is the back. Should it go right at the back, guys? The fan? Or like in the middle? Probably at the very back, right? do two. We're going to make like the killer whale from G.I. Joe. That's the goal here. Uh, R. Wait, did I put them on backwards? No, that's right. Right? Pretty sure that's right. <coughs> yeah, look at this. 100% complete. 500 bucks. <laughs> danger? What danger was? I need to get some guns, yeah. I mean, <laughs> mm. well, <laughs> uh, go. They're not teaching me how to use the batteries. They just keep saying when the time is right. Oh, God.
Ah. Look, I hit the fans. You're right. Uh, okay. Uh, how do you steer it, though? I have it turned around. Hang on. I gotta turn it around the other way. I gotta put it like this. Oh, crap. But where do we want to go? Like, you just want to try it out, right? Yeah, we just want to try it out, so... Okay, okay, stop. Okay, and then the battery charges. Okay. Holy learning curve. Wow. I can't steer it. I can't steer it. Go G.I. Joe Killer Whale right here. There's got to be a way to steer it, right? Okay, turn it off. Turn it off. Interesting. weapon to generate a spark. <gasps> yeah, the batteries recharge if you leave it. Yeah, you don't have to keep hunting for batteries, which is good. Fire can be used either to cook or warm yourself. How do I start a fire? Come in using flint as a fire starter. Place flint. Don't burn flint. Place flint next to the bundle of wood and strike it with a metallic or stone weapon. There definitely has to be a way to steer it. Maybe you get, maybe you have to find like a steering wheel compartment. I don't know. Maybe there's like different levels to making a hovercraft. You know what I mean? Or maybe you find schematics and learn how to do it. I don't know. <sighs> do I have a weapon? Well, I have this big thing. Do I have this? Oh, there's a broadsword. Okay, we're going to take that. Great, we can make another, like, pottery sword. Okay, so we got to learn how to do this. So let's just learn now. Oops, that's the wrong, completely wrong button. Uh, we got to do... Hold. Drop, right? How do you drop it? So A to the edge weapon and strike them. Okay. Now my sword's on fire. Okay, now I lit that. Now we can cook some food. So these are the peppers. Hold. Hold. 
<laughs> Spicy peppers grants cold resistance for five minutes. We've beat the game. Oh my god. Ooh. I could be an engineer. Well, when you guys start to play this, we'll all be engineers. We'll be able to rule. It's going to be great. I knew the peppers from the last game would be the cold resistance for sure. Uh, I don't think I have any more. Good thing I found those peppers. Bundles of wood, and this is flint, so we can make more fire. This is opal. Oh, ghetto, where the hell is that? So there is a steering wheel. I figured that. I figured there'd be very primitive ways. Whoop, 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 whoop. Primitive ways for the, um, the hovercraft all the way up to sophisticated where you'll be able to actually steer it. Uh, okay, let's make a... Oh my god, you can make like a plant sword. Mo, oh, you're a mechanical engineer? There you go, buddy. Then you'll be perfect in this game. Oh, we can make... Wood box broadsword. Here we go. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Yes! Watch out, Ganon. So good. And then we can light it on fire. Okay. Let me think. Light it on fire? Uh, well, we gotta get back over to the other side again. Because we have to, we have the cold resistance now, which is what we needed for the last shrine. I have to get over there. Wow, we got to go all the way to the right. So I do, it looks like, have to go back across. No, wait. Yeah. Oh, easy, 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 easy. Okay. Box sword. Go. Engaged. Dun, 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 dun. This is the most ridiculous thing you'll see all day. Link on a hovercraft with a box sword. Oh, my God. This game rules. Guys, wasn't that fantastic? I clipped that. That was great. Link in a hovercraft with a, a box. Like, it looks like Road Pig's weapon. Look at it. gonna see again if I can maybe add something to it. I don't think I can, but we're gonna try anyway. Wood box club. Nah, we can't. That's okay. Come closer to me. God, look it down there. It's Hyrule. Should we just, let's just jump. 
if you put a single fan on it, it would just go in a circle. Yeah, that's the problem that the very first thing I couldn't figure out with the board and the hook was everyone was telling me to put it in the center, and I wasn't. So it was like the actual physics of it wasn't working properly. So yeah, and that was my first draft. Remember the first draft? It was just two logs. It wasn't heavy enough. Am I going to make this jump? No, oh, I guess we're going to find out. Oh, boy. You want to go? You'll never defeat Box Sword Link. Oh, maybe I'll beat him a bit. Oh, I'm hurt, I'm hurt, I'm hurt. Oh, that was close. The apple's pretty, pretty good for regenning health. I really want my sword, man. Oh, it killed me. Wow, that took one and a half, one and a half hearts off. <coughs> I didn't read that, sorry. It's like a truck, this guy. Okay. Now what I need is something better. Let's do this. I need a shield is what I need. Oh! <laughs> See ya! See ya, bud. That works, too. What was up here? I probably get the shield, I would say, when I land on Hyrule. Yeah, I bullied that guy right off the map. Uh oh, I fell down here. What's down? There's nothing down here. Oh boy. Oh golly. Right, yeah, there's nothing down here. What's what is up there? I can't even see what's up there. Oh chest. Diabolical. What oh I don't want to use my amiibo. Hey, actually, you know what? I have my Majora's mask amiibo. I wonder what that will do. See if that does anything. Here we go. I think you have to activate in the options, which I don't have activated right now. I'll tell you how to do it in the other one. That'll be interesting to see what all the the Zelda ones do that you've collected over the years for this game. <coughs> the old one was cool. It gave you every twenty four hours you could tap the amiibo, and it would give you certain. Uh, like certain legendary weapons and stuff. But again, they just broke really quickly. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to have to do. I'm kind of stuck down here. Wish I didn't come down here now. Can't reach him. Hmm. 
Well, I'm not going to have the endurance, I don't think, to get up here. Well, we're going to try, I guess. Okay, I can rest in between here, so that's not bad. Oh, boy. Rest, young one. Come on, Link. You can do it, buddy. Oh, good job. All right. Which way do we have to go? Wow, look how far away it is. I'm trying to see how we're going to get there. Cliffhanger link, absolutely. Which way is it? Stupid mini map. Oh, goody, it's these guys again. <coughs> the Korok seeds have made a triumphant return. Yippee. Bye. to go that way. <laughs> Throw the rock back. No one I know. So here is the final shrine. Like <clears throat> these broken up areas are making it really difficult. I guess we just gotta kind of explore, right? With a uh, box sword. Edge of the world. Hi, buddy. Whoa. Oh, this is that area we were at before. I don't want to have to turn around and go all the way back. We know that we could start... We, we started to go up that winter mountain. We just didn't have any cold resistance, cold weather resistance. We do now. Now I just have to figure out how to get back there. Yeah, that's just a dead end there. Well, there's that chest, but... I don't know how to get it right now. I guess we're turning around. Uh, can I climb down here? Yeah, no, 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 no. Dang, I almost died. I was close. This is spicy. It's for cold resistance. Hard.
Eat it up, pig. Good job. So I guess we go across this river, then traverse this way up through here. Yeah, since that other way was a dead end. Where's my boat? Where's my boat? What? Oh, come on, man. I gotta <laughs> do it again? Link's gonna have an eating disorder, is that what you're saying? I, well, I certainly hope not. He's gotta heal himself, though. He's gonna be uh, sick of mushrooms. Uh, can't tell which side. thing always wants to take off. <coughs> Excuse me. Go! That's why those fences are here, because we don't have the plans to make a steering wheel yet. Otherwise, we'd shoot off the side of the, uh, the area. So I guess that makes sense. So that's just going to lead us into a circle. Do it this way. Hey, buddy, what do you have to say? So we're just going in, in this cave again? Oh, what are we doing? They're not going to make me go all the way back around, are they? So I'm trying to figure out a way to get around. <coughs> oh yeah, one and then you can reverse. That's a smart idea. got time for you guys. I'm out of here. Okay, now where are we? Oh, look, it's something new. Oh, Indiana Jones carts, it looks like. Obviously, we're going to try this. How's that? Oh, wrong way! <laughs> Why didn't you guys tell me I was going the wrong way? 
classic. Classic Bartlett. Yank. Cats try. Oops, there we go. That was fun. Okay, let's try that again. Hey, wait, what's that? Shiny. Hang on, hang on. Oh, we need flint. We need this. Can't carry any more melee weapons. Oh, it's just a stupid stick. Okay, let's go. Temple of Doom style. Go! Yo, Joe! Dun, 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 dun. Oh god. I'm just trusting this like random track. Oh, I'm scared. I'm so scared. I can't Okay. Okay, well that was fun. I mean, right? Stop. That was kind of fun. We need those two light dark places. Fair. Uh, you know, bloody brooms require stimulant to blossom. Of course they do. Striking a bright bloom seed or attaching it to an arrow. Okay. No! I don't want to talk to you again. The text box trap. Get me out of here. I don't need to see nothing. Uh, they're really, like, teaching you, like, everything here. So we got to go through... So now we have to You know what? I haven't saved it yet. I should probably save it, right? That's hilarious. We haven't saved in like 4 hours. There's auto saves, thank God, but okay. Bright bloom seed. What did they say strike it with something? Hold. Uh, oh, don't put it away. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Interesting. mining nodes that we can't use oh my god if I hit that button one more time I really want to mine that but we can't really do anything with it at this present time unless we make a pickaxe is there pickaxe material in here Cause there's lots of stuff. Wait a minute. Let's use this. Can't we make like, let's see what we can make here. We can make wood stick, wood stick. Wood stick rock. Uh, I was hoping one of these like mining nodes would attach to it. That would be hilarious. This big diamond rock. Yeah, I don't want to waste time with that. Is this a forge?
Guys, <clears throat> there is so much to learn in this game. Like, I don't know. This is just like the tutorial level. We've had to learn like 50 things. How many times has this guy said, are you unfamiliar with? And every time I'm like, I don't even know what you're talking about, man. Okay, this is Zonite, as I mentioned. It's a unique mineral that can be mined far beneath the land below. Smelting the furnace, I figured that. I converted into materials, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I'll try to break it. I need uh, something sharp. I'm sure he's going to teach me how to use a pickaxe here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, zone charges. Use it occasionally. Solidify into a form known as crystallized charges. Converting zonite into other useful materials is a is a way called processing. Oh my god. Okay. Zonite charges are what power zoni devices and constructs. Charge can be consumed to replenish your energy cell. Crystallized charges. Are a solidified form of zonite charges. Okay. <laughs> Do you remember rupees? Does anyone have any rupees? We mainly use them for raw materials. Okay. Please visit anytime you require. Cool. Scott says maybe the constructs are connected some uh, some way. They're machines, right? So they're probably like the Geth or the Borg. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go back. Spider-Man. Huh. Okay, so I'm a little, little confused. Uh, exchange. Previously had ample resources is gradually yielding yes and yet less and less. This is why I require support. Let's therefore continue to mine without resting. Okay. When I can't take his stuff, he'll yell at me. Job. <laughs> my mind like <laughs> my mind is uh out there right now i'm just like spinning there's so much information i'm not saying it's it's a bad thing just right now it's like a blah <laughs> oh there's mine carts there but I don't have any... F is there a fan around? No kidding, eh? It's pretty in-depth. I mean, it's it's really good. And I'm sure once everything is in place and we all understand what we need to do, it's going to be a very enriching amazing incredible experience like it's pretty great so far a um, few minor gripes here and there but again I want to do one dungeon before I 
totally judge this thing. Okay, this thing, we don't have any power, so getting in it's not going to do anything. I don't want to friggin' fly around in this thing. Look at that. I don't think so. You think I'm crazy? But what do we need to... We need a fan, right? Where are we going to get a fan from? What does this do? Attach. What is it? Yeah, the detail's great. I like this. The infusing thing is like made the game for me. And coach. I mean, you could just. You know, <laughs> I don't want to die here, but. Oh God! See, we would—that would have been us. That would have been us. Here. Oh my god, I hate heights. I'm so scared. Okay. Shush. Alright, back. Back on. Whoa, 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 whoa. <sighs> it's a rock, yeah, I know. But we can't really go any farther here. Oh, those are fans right there. I'm not giving you permission to take those. Well, I need one. I need two. What? Oh, you don't. There's a third thing we got to learn in this cave. Hang on. Here we go. I don't know what you're talking about, guy. Carrying portable Zonai devices it is unfortunate. You seem to have none. Okay. I didn't know the portable fan course. Well, now I know it. Okay, hang on. Hang on a second. Oh, my God. You guys doing okay? Hanging in there? Whew. So who, who else bought this? I know Jeff bought it. At least you guys know when you start playing it what to do and what not to do, right? Zonai Engineering. You're going to have a PhD in Zonai Engineering all for the next game that comes out in six or seven years to just completely ignore all of it and all that info that you spent all the time to learn is now useless. can't be put back in the pouch so once we pull them out that's it well first thing we got to do is take this rock out because that was stupid and you get out of here see so yeah, that's gonna hit somebody on the head in Hyrule and like murder them ouch JT, now, yeah, now's the time, man. So you never got one for Breath of the Wild, eh? Canadian, see? I did the A thing. Uh, okay, now where do I use the portable fan thingy? Oh, right there. Okay. Take out device. Okay. Uh, It makes a predator noise. Is this the right way? Oh, that doesn't look like it's going to work. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's just bring this back here. Away from the edge. Okay. Now, let's pull this fan off. We'll wiggle. Pull it off. Is that the right way? Yeah, that's the right way, right? 
Like that? Yeah. You think one's going to do it? What, the A? You just noticed the A? Oh my god, what's this big stick I have? Uh, let's use this. Buckle up. Do you think this is going to work, or do you think we need two? Because we can put two on this thing. And by the way, I don't even have it centered. And there's a Rebel Alliance symbol, like, right there. Ish. Well, it won't show us now. Worth a shot. You just, you guys want to see me fall off the track. All right, well, here we go. Buckle up. Here we go. One, two, three. Go. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This is friggin' amazing. We did this. We created this. So cool. Stanley, it's pretty good. It's actually pretty good. Uh, shut it off. Shut it off. Charge the battery. Okay. Oh, okay. It's uh, Stanley. There's a lot to learn. Can I? Well, there was a fan just lying around there, so I. I reused that one for nothing, or I used that one for nothing. Man, that's so Bioshock Infinite. I just want to keep writing it. Do you know how many awesome, like, videos that people are going to make? I can't wait to see everyone's imagination just go crazy with this stuff. Gone with the wind, yeah. Exactly. Now what? The t I got to learn about the time bell? Stop! I can't learn anymore. I can't. Just put me in a dungeon and let me fight somebody. Hmm. All right, well, whatever. Yeah, I got a couple of good ones out of it already, Jeff. Um, what the, is this like a, what? Device dispenser. Oh, do you want to use the device dispenser? Uh, sure. Oh my God. I can't learn anymore. Stop it. Stop it. Just give me to the temple. I can't learn anymore. I literally, I'm, I'm reading, like I'm reading through the text. I can't even comprehend it. Pendragon, what's up? How you doing, man? Good to see you. Welcome to Zelda. Tears of the Kingdom, a.k.a. You have to have an engineering degree. Yeah, my brain is on overload. You can process resources that you hold by dropping them in the receptacle. Oh, God, now Zodiac capsules. I need a sip. Zodiac capsules are portable. I, I keep calling it Zodiac. That's what I'm seeing. Zoni capsules are portable Zoni devices in convenient pocket form. What? It, what? What the hell's a Zoni device? The hell's an aluminum falcon? The device cannot be put back in its capsule after you remove it. They intended to be disposable. So does that mean I can go and take one of those engines, put it in there, and store it in here? That would be cool. Take a sip and regroup, yeah. I think I'm on my fourth coffee. 
I'm starting to get dehydrated. The coffee is starting to outweigh the water, which is not good. <laughs> but I need my energy. This one's a drainer on your mind. I mean, in a good way. Uh, okay, so if I do this, take out, cancel, no. Okay, hang on, hang on. So this engine is here. So can we take this and put it in here? No. I mean, I really wasn't reading what he said. Yeah, okay. I'm going to have to read. You think it's too big? I'm going to read what he said again. I'm sorry. Like, my mind is mush. Let me try and focus here. <sighs> Device dispensers produce portable Zonai devices in the form of Zonai capsules. Okay, got it. They can process construct horns and zonai charges. I don't get it. Do you guys get what that means? What does that mean? The other ones I have will fit. But Scott, it says like those engines we got, if I take it says if you take it out, remember they said you can't put it back. Do you know what I mean? Those two engines we got, or those three engines we got. Pendragon it yeah, it's there's a lot to it. Um, which is good. But overall, yeah, you learn a lot. Granted, I mean, I've been playing for like four hours now. Almost five. So it's probably not that difficult, right? It's just all at once. The Oh, dude, you're going, yeah. Put those shelves up. I appreciate you hanging out, man, for sure. We'll see you on the next stream. Cheers, mate. <clears throat> Take the one from the cart. Okay, hang on. We'll do that in a second. Let me just read this. Using them? Okay. Use them by dropping any resource held in your hands into the receptacle. Okay. It's similar to a cooking pot. Okay. Goodbye. Okay, so now let's go grab this engine. Okay, I think we got it. Pick it up. Put it here. I think it's too big. It's too big. Yeah, so you know uh, in Breath of the Wild, Pendragon, how you, f you throw all the ingredients into the cooking pot. This is the same kind of thing. So we have a device... Which is called the Ultra Hand, by the way, which is a friggin' amazing nod to like old school Nintendo fans. So the Ultra Hand, basically it's like the Sheikah Slate. And what they're saying is we can take devices, see how it's like one of those 25 cent gumball machine things? So we could take items, place them in here, I think, and it saves them for later. And there'll be these um, dispensaries all over Hyrule. That's what I think it means. But we're just trying to figure out what exactly. Because you need the... Like, you can put engines on these cars here. And make, like, hovercrafts. And stuff like that. Like, this is where we came up with our homemade... It's, I guess it's a... Not a hovercraft. A go-kart, whatever you want to call it. Okay, Scott. So Scott was saying, take one from the cart. Let's grab this. Oh, you can't grab it. Well, you can. Oh, no, you have to pick it up. You have to pick it up with your hands. Pick it up. I'm just seeing what will go in here. Yeah, all this stuff's too big, so maybe this stuff here. Nope. All right.
right. I'm confused. I'm confused with what this does. <coughs> I need to reach my friend. Oh, what is that? Is that a quest? Oh my god, is that an actual per- It's a person! In a Zelda game! It's a quest! Okay. I'm not doing this side quest right now. I want to figure this out because it's going to be a crucial component to the game. Anyone have any ideas? I mean, I can read it again. But it's not sticking. This one's not sticking with me. So that would be ingredients, I would say, from my menu. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't get it. That produces wind. What do you do? Yeah, I, I don't I don't get it. So I guess we're gonna move on because I don't understand that one. Nope. Look at these boards here. I wonder if we can do like uh make like a a plane or something. That would be pretty cool with these fans. These boxes. Well, we need one of these carts to get over there. I mean, at this point, am I even going the right way? <laughs> I need to get home to my friend. Shut up. Stop for a Okay, I'm just going to check again if we're going the right way. Yeah, so this is going to lead there. And then we got to go here. I'd say we're about halfway there. Just Googled it. Well, thank you. Let's see. To use the Zonai portable pod, navigate to the Zonai device tab in Link's inventory and locate the Zonai device. Select it and choose take out the device. Oops. Uh, Zonai device. So there's just this. This is all we have. So if we take this out, we can put it back. And we're going to take it out and see. Yeah, this is just the same. I'm confused. It's way too big. Well, you know what we're going to do? We're going to make an ultra fast one now that we've taken the engine out. Ultra fast. Uh, 
rip that off. Let's uh, put that right, uh, right there. On the edge, yeah, this is gonna be a turbo one. Yeah, that's right, a turbo one. Okay, now let's go right here. Oh yeah, look at this thing. Oh ho 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 ho! All right, what was the wrong way? <laughs> That's okay. I can fix this. I can fix this. I am a Zonai engineer, after all. So we just got to hold this, and what we got to do is just do the old rotator. Like that. Okay. And we can just put that right there. Up the front, Jay. Try to, sl try to slot in front of the pot. Slot in the wall. Slot in the wall. I, I don't. I don't understand. Try the slot in front of the pot. Sorry, man. I'm not. I'm not getting it. The circle bit on the wall, like this thing. <coughs> That's where they come out of, right? The circle bit on the wall. Yeah, I'm not getting it. That might have to be for uh, next stream. I think my brain's fried. It's not. It's not you. I just. It's not computing anymore. Okay, I'll wait. I'll wait here. I don't know if you want to control or like uh, copy and paste it. I better not, because I'm going to accidentally smack the fans, and then we're going to go. Look at this thing ready to go, though. Let's have some fun with this. Hey, let's try uh, yeah, this. Put that on there. That won't uh, won't attach to both, or will it? Can't quite get it. <laughs> Look at this thing. What else we got here? Okay, we'll take the big one. Let's take the big one. The objective here is to make... Oh, God. Is to make this baby fly. You, get out of here. You, let's go. Ah, I can't. I can't miss. Let's go. Well, it didn't fly. I tried. Come on, does that not look like a reasonable plane to you? <laughs> oh, no, not the hook again. I'm out. All right, where are we? Where are we now? Okay. We gotta go across again another way. This unusual mineral that has many purposes. Oh, sorry, unusual mineral that has many purposes. Weapons and armor. 
So what I can use crafting here. Dang. It's the strongest box I've ever seen. But it's not strong enough for boulder sword. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Pots, you don't stand a chance for Boulder Sword. I mean, there's a lot of random junk around Hyrule these days, wouldn't you agree? What's this stupid thing? Oh, it's a cart. Man, they really want you to, like, build these carts. Like, look at this. Another one. Oh, that, that track's busted. Oh, how are we going to get around that? I just learned how to make a cart. Now you want me to fix the track? Hmm. Well. Oh, do we have to do it? Oh, do we have to do it? Sad fashion. <laughs> My brain is fried. We have to do it. We have to fix the track. I don't want to fix the track. I don't want to fix the track at all. Okay, sh shush. Get on the track. Okay. Son of a... It's okay, buddy. It's not your explanation. Again, my brain is d done. Yeah, I can't even... Uh, I can't process it. The, you, you learn a lot in this game real quick. But that's fine because... You know, obviously you need the info for something. Now, how are we going to fix this? Look at that gap in the track. How are we going to do that? Jeff, do you think Nintendo did this to annoy speedrunners? I wonder. I really wonder. Good afternoon, Dale. Good to see you, buddy. I don't know. I could just see, like, some of the people in Nintendo being like, oh, okay, well, you can beat Majora's Mask in one second. Well, didn't you say somebody beat it in 94 minutes? Is that what you said at the beginning of the stream? I think they have I think they have too. I think they're forcing us and, and I love speedrunners, don't get me wrong, but it seems like they're just kind of forcing us to maybe enjoy it a bit more. Do you know what I mean? Just to slow down and kind of take things in. We need fans. There's two here and a hook. Two fans and a hook. Okay. Two fans and a hook. got it oh no I don't wait a minute what if we did no hang on what if we did this okay just follow my train of thought here not not that part stop it okay what if we took it right place it underneath here attach the hook in the middle and then blow it that's what we got to do. So instead of going on top of the tracks, we're going to go under the track. 
That means we have to wiggle this off and put this on the very back. I think one fan will do it. Okay, now we're going to get the hook and place it in the middle. And then we're going to put it up there. What do you think? Uh, the original Doom speedruns are fantastic. That's a fun game to watch. Uh, the hook screws me up because the shape of it. Put the hook at the front. Okay. Uh, <coughs> oh, the hook shape just screws me up. This is what gave us the problem last time. Okay. Uh... the hook at the front, but we gotta make it sideways. Hmm, I don't know if that'll work. Let's try. If this works... If, if this works, look at this thing. Oh, God. I feel like evil can evil every time we make one of these things. And Link's like the test. I mean, look at him. He's like, I once was the hero of time. I once was in a wicked game called Majora's Mask where the moon was going to crash down. I had three days. It was so brilliant. Now you've got me. And Banjo Kazooie nuts and bolts putting together garbage. And it's super fun. Okay, here we go. Ready? Get the old boulder sword out. Like, imagine this. Okay, sorry, I'm gonna do it. Just look at this screenshot right here. Imagine if in the new game informer or whatever, let's just say there was still magazines. If they showed, all right, we have exclusive picks on the new Zelda game, and you saw this picture. <laughs> Everyone would be like, oh, I'm good. All right, here we go. Oh, my God, it worked. It worked. I can't believe it worked. It worked. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Easy, easy, easy. My battery's low. My battery's low. My battery's low. Shush. Shut up. All right. Good job, hook cart. You did it. Guys, we did it. I figured that out five hours in. I think that's pretty damn good. I'm just saying. I think that's pretty good. Now where the heck are we? We are here. We're getting there. It's, we're about halfway still. Uh, okay. So now, this way. <clears throat> okay. There's a chest coming up, so that's nice. Give it. Master Sword. Portable pot. Uh, what? A Zonai device for cooking food almost anytime, anywhere. It lasts for cooking one recipe only. The device is easier to use on flat surfaces. Okay. That's good. I mean, that's good, right? I love the scale. There's that uh, Zonai gumball dispenser thing that we're trying to figure out. Look, there's our old cart right there. The old plane cart. Okay, let's focus. We're here. We just came from there. Oh my god, I'm so... I'm lost. Back up here. 
I know we got a porta potty. Okay, this is gonna get us nowhere. <coughs> Straight down and then over. It looks like we can get across. I hope. I hope. Oh, there's the snow area. Oh my god, there's the snow area. Okay, okay. 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 All right. Now the problem here is that there's so much distracting me. Ew, gross. Used porta potty. We're gonna go in here because curiosity is, you know, never led us astray before. Oh, it's peppers, so we can make some more uh, cold resistance. That's good. Good. Cold resistance. <laughs> All right. Do we want to explore this cave? Or do we want to go to our destination? Look at this stupid weapon. Look at this thing. Your boulder hammer is badly damaged. Wait, can I heat this thing up? I don't think so. I thought I saw it smoking. The snowy mountain above us is extremely cold. Prepared travelers will swiftly lose uh, fertility or even die. I'm all set. Thank you. I know about the peppers. I know all about the peps. Appreciate it, though. Cheers. Did they drop anything? I mean, we'll take the eyeball. The key's eyeball. Oh god, where have I taken us? Where are we? I hope we're headed in the right direction. Oh, there's one of those frog things. What? What happened? Your old wooden bow broke. Oh, well, you know what? That's one of those things we need. <sighs> okay, I'll try and climb down. Try and climb down. Just, just take it easy. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or I just broke my anks. Yeah, we got the cold thing covered. Jeff, you're right. We got that. Don't worry. I got another another uh, boulder. I got boulder stick this time. There we go. The old boulder stick. Look, we can see the destination on the map. Okay, that leads us through there. Okay. Well, we got one of those frog things. Oh. Our bow just exploded in our hands. That's kind of silly. Okay, let me look at our destination. It's pretty far, but we got lots of these peppers. <coughs> we have two for five minutes. So we're going to have to burn it there. 
Okay, here we go. Go. These services are hard to climb. You son of a This is not the way either. So it's through that cave. It's gotta be. Damn, and I used the peppers. Okay, so there w must have been another way through that cave. The peppers respawn. Good, 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 good. got this. You're all right. <coughs> Barely. Okay. Now. Jesus. <coughs> Run. I'm just running. I don't care what's there. Man, that's bright. It looks great. Oh, it's up there. I see it. Oh, boy. I'm aggroing everything. And stopping for nothing. Okay. Get away from me. You don't need to see nothing. I think we're going in here. Sorry, dude. What's the cat? The camera's giving you vertigo. Flower. Where's my hook shot, please? Thank you very much. Oh, what's that thing? Take you home. Let's go. Ew. Maybe I'll just run by you. buddy you're heading out cool dude thanks for hanging out so much a lot of fun today we'll see you tonight get some rest oh god slugworm <gasps> shield yes whoa Did I just get a flamethrower? What is this? I thought I just picked up a shield. Hang on a second. What is this? Flame emitter shield. Wow. I guess you can make uh, shields out of things. Oops. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. Come on, I want that chest, buddy. So let's go. Let's freaking go. Awesome. Uh-oh. Switch over. 
Oh. Oh, <laughs> so good. That was fun. Two chests right there. Oh, bull. Oh, another one of those Zonai devices that shoots fire. It's thought to have originally used as protection from monsters. Well, I mean, that makes sense. Did I get a sword? Did I really? I didn't even see that. What's this? Like, like stone. Did I get a sword? Hang on. I don't think it is. I still have this reaper. A rapier, or reaper, or whatever you want to call it. To my right. Oh, rusty broadsword. But you know what that means? Thank you, by the way. That means that we can make it into something like stone thing. Oh, can we make treasure chest sword? No. Rock sword. That's not good enough. Man, that flamethrower thing is friggin' cool. Uh, okay, let's turn that off. Where are we? We're so close. We're getting there. Oh, we're cold again. Cold resistance for five more minutes. Let's go. It's like right here. It's up a little bit more. We're almost there. Wow. To say that, that this was a far hike to get to this last one would be a complete understatement. Wow. This isn't even Hyrule yet. Where is it up here? Oh, it's right there. So we're going to go around still? Oh, man. What? Looks like we're going to have to... Hey, a raft boat. Maybe we can make a raft boat. Yeah, I gotta climb down. Uh. Damn. It's badly damaged until now. <laughs> Ta -da! Log stick. Log sword. Ow. Dang it. Okay. Uh, those peppers over there? Oh, so much to look at. Okay. I'm officially tapping out for now. I have to. I need a break. Woo! Okay. I'm going to grab some food. I will see you guys very shortly. 8 o'clock tonight.
We're doing Masks 1986, okay? Make sure you come back. Hang out with Chad and I. It's going to be a great night. Hey, guys, thanks. That was a really fun launch stream for Zelda. I had a blast with you guys. Thanks for the help. Thanks for making me laugh. <laughs> and thanks for uh, keeping me company. I hope I did the same for you guys. We'll see you in a couple short hours, okay? See you soon, guys. Take care.